I need a new hobby. And welcome to some cheeky Death Stranding sponsored stream, eh? God blimey. 
Making our way in the world of live streaming free copies of games. Core cool, geezer. Quite looking forward to this, actually. It's got a lot of hate. But hey, it's free. <laughs> and, and it's a break from seven days, I suppose. So, uh, and, and I, I think I'm quite interested to see just the general graphical fidelity of the game as well. I mean, it's uh, there's going to be a lot of walking. It'll be interesting to see just how fun a game can make walking. I'm... Uh, yeah, I'm pl pleasantly intrigued by it all, to be honest. I've stayed on complete... Uh... In fact, it's weird, actually. I asked the girlfriend to get me to a point in the game, as I quite often do, um, where I would be able to play about graphical settings to see if, you know, I, I need to lock in V-Sync or play about. So uh, I I've kind of got to a point where I can move my character, but she couldn't skip the cutscenes, or I I'm sure you can, but she, she couldn't figure out how to do it. So she actually ended up playing it a bit yesterday. And I actually noticed when I booted it up this morning, she's actually got some achievements. <laughs> I didn't realise because I had to loop out. She, she said to me like... Walking Sim 2020. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, hang on, have I missed Axos? I, honestly, if anybody says walking, it's walking Sim throughout today, right? I'm just going to ban them because I just don't need that sort of shit, all right? <laughs> <laughs> so basically, Caskill, thanks, thanks for reminding me. I, I should have made that really clear at the start. You know, it's walking sim, mate. It's walking sim. Thanks, Caskill. Thank you for the nine, mate. Grubonian love child. Thank you for the prime. Daxos. Thank you for the forty-four. Sorry, mate. That must have come through while I was uh, just coming back into the room. Thank you very much for the forty-four, Daxos, and thank you for the nine, Caskill. Yeah. Um. She she, she said she was just like the, the cutscene at the start. She was just like it ended up just like complete like whoa, what the hell. She said apparently the um the face is looking incredible. And you know, she's not a gamer, so but yeah, it's uh yeah, good. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh who's this in chat? It's Mr. Sandy. How you doing, Sandy? All right, let's have a quick catch up with everybody. We've got Daxos. Good morning, Daxos. Morning, Wookie. Morning, Chantal. You're in very early today. Doc has things. You're right, Wookie. You got a coffee, have you, mate? Good morning, Alison. I hope Bob's in everyone's well. Good morning, Advina. You have a big day today. Lots of games for you, Advina. Adam, good morning, Krieg, good morning. Missy, good morning. Skaldash, good morning. Shades, good morning. Oh, guys, do you want me to put the server on? Oh, let me put the server on. One second. Sorry, forgot to do that, actually. Yeah, so server should be up. Well, it'll be up in about three or four minutes and normally takes more to be up. Thanks, Gaskell. Thank you very much, bro. Uh, let me go back down there. You're right, Gavin. How are you doing, sir? You're right, future. Bit of Royal Mail Sim. That's, that's more like it. Yeah, a bit of a... I think, what are they called? Are they called... P P no, I can't remember what they're called. You're right, Blower. How are you doing, bro? You are right, Huffy? <laughs> I can't resist a threat, so here's to enjoying the walking sim. Yeah, Laughing whatever. face. Whatever. War off a duck's back. I can't help it if you're all jaded, playing the same old crap day in, day out. That time you all uh, experienced something new. Right, let's have a look. I think I think everything's set up, so we'll go for... We'll just go for new game. Thanks for the bits, Doc. Thank you for the bits. Uh, Yes. Right, okay. Uh, normal, presumably, then, yeah. Start the game at the selected level. The difficulty level can be changed at any time via the options. Yes, okay. Uh, well, well, it's big enough, doesn't it? Right, I've got a coffee. I, from what the girlfriend said, there's quite, quite a lengthy intro, so... Oh, uh, now, I'm not sure... I mean, that's pretty good my end. And probably a little bit too bright your end, but it'll probably help. There's a lot of old farts out there like Doc, aren't there? So a bit of visual impairment. So we'll leave, we'll leave it a bit brighter for them. Sadie and his bifocals and things. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. Uh, oh, what's this? The, uh, Doom's ability is very according to the sufferer's date of birth. In order to establish your own a bit... Uh, okay. Oh dear, that's good enough. Is this your birthday? Yes. 
Higher levels of Doom's abilities have been observed in those born under constellations such as Cancer, Pisces, Cetus, Delphinus, and Gigas. What the, what's that all about? It's a mystery. It's a scoop. Ooh. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave birth to time and space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which set a planet spinning in that space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life.
send them out. It's so weird actually having a character that sort of has. It's I can't really. I'll, I'll wait until later before I even comment. It's, uh, it's going to take a while to get used to, I think. Did I just run over? I've got no idea, Missy. I don't know. Just, just like this weird ghost lady just in the middle of nowhere. It looks like this rain. Is, is it some sort of like acid rain or something? It looks like it looked like the bird was uh, getting fried. Don't know what all these uh, buttons down bottom left are. Jump, climb, climb continuously. Okay. <sighs> Did I pick up the other boxes lying around? Oh god, I didn't, did I? <laughs> I'm so, so lost in wondering around, Flora. Let's go and have a look. Let's go and have a look. How did I get... Where was I? Did I go from up there? Oh wow, the terrain is mad. It's like really weird the way he's like... So, so, oh my god, the, 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 the amount of animations in this must be, must be insane. Where did Hello, I, uh, where Norman did I Reedus. Oh, no, Plower. I've probably oh, boffed it from the start, mate. <laughs> Doc, thank you for the bits. Caskell, thank you for the nine. Daxos, thank you for the 44. Darth Ripley, thank you for the 43, bro. I don't even know where I was, uh, Plower. I reckon, I reckon, I reckon I boffed it, mate. Was there something, was something on the floor, wasn't there? Right at the start, mate. Use the scanner. Oh, God. I actually just pressed LB. Or was it RB? Oh, God. Jesus, God, that made me jump. Hang on a minute. Uh, is that, is that right? What's all these things do? Monster energy drink product placement at its so what's this thing doing? What's this? Is this is this what you meant by the scanner? I don't think there is anything like Is this blind completely blind mate? Yeah, I've, I've seen nothing of this. I've seen a few uh, trailers and things before it came out. I knew I'd pick it up at some point, mate, so I'd, I'd literally stayed away from all the hoo ha over it. Did No Man's Sky have an update? It did recently, Captain Vage. Yeah? Had a really big update. They, uh, didn't they add cross-platform play and things? Thanks ever so much, Darth. How are you doing, mate? How's things? Oh my god, that's a tier 3 as well, Darth. So sorry, dude. I missed that. Thank you very much, Darth. Thank you for the tier 3 gold sub. Is that actually my... That's my footprints, right? Why are they showing up there? Is that because I did the scanner thing, or...? God, that's the rain sounds insane in my headset. I, I feel like I'm getting a bit chilly out here. <laughs> Damn, that looks insane, bro. Oh my god, man. All right, let's let's go back up to where we're supposed to be. That's a good idea, actually, Missy. I think, I think it's too late. I probably boffed it from the start. I probably missed, like, a crucial bit of gear. It's going to have an entire playthrough without a crucial piece of gear, Missy.
Oh, fuck that. Yeah, that's Norman Reedus, uh, Chantal, as you recognise him from The Walking Dead. So he's actually a very good friend of Hideo Kojima's, so... I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor, but I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Some Porter Bridges. The man who delivers. Yeah. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, she's not. You I thought she was going to wheat it. A crypto buy it a day keeps the time fall away. Oh, God, she's not. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> Enjoy your sausage sandwich this morning. Oh, come on. Want to come work for me? Must be tough out here on your own. 
Yeah, I thought the Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few of his folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. And I can't help you with that. I make deliveries, that's all. This is Bridges Central Dispatch. Freelance contractor Sam Porter Bridges. Receiver is standing by for drop. Headed into town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. I want one. Fast forwards, whatever it touches. Ah. We can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. So Sam it's not. Bridges. Oh wow! What the hell? Well, when it said time flow, I was thinking it was like acid rain or something. It it's actually. Well, unless I've completely misinterpreted that, it actually ages you, right? Oh god, oh god, what? Well, hang on. Uh, right, red bar, blood gauge. When it reaches zero, Sam will die. The blue is the stamina bar. Okay, makes sense. Alright, okay. Uh, and we're off. Oh, Jesus, that's a long way, mate. Um. Oh, what the hell, bro? What's all these things? Oh. So that's camera mode. That's my monster energy drink. Stamina restoring energy drink. Any time full or other water that comes into contact with the canteen is absorbed, filtered, and mixed with the energy particles inside. The canteen has also been treated with antifreeze tank. Oh, I wonder if there's like... Is that, is that like saying there's going to be like different biomes or something? Alright, uh. Take it, we're not. Oh, what's that? That red bush has got stuff coming out of it, look. Yeah, I, I, want, a, I want a high tech umbrella like that, Chantal. <laughs> it just looked really cool, mate. <laughs> oh, that music's gorgeous. Oh, the, oh these are the things. These are, these are the things, look. The crypto biotes. Oh shit, they've all just fucked off. Oh bollocks. Oh, so you need to grab them a bit quick then. Oh, that's my bad. That music's awesome. Yeah, shivel you up. Yeah, I didn't do it quick enough, but I thought I'd just have a little zoom in and have a look at them, but uh I can see it feels weird. It's actually really cool. The feedback on the uh, Xbox Elite's mad. I definitely wouldn't want to play this with a mouse and keyboard. Oh, 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 hey, what was that? I'll see. Oh, look at that. Oh, neat. Oh wow, that makes a huge difference. It like uh, changes like the center of mass, doesn't it? Oh, that's actually really cool. You got a book rabbit? How you doing? You got a Skaldesh? God, that was freaking insane. So, can I get across there? Take it that walk. Is that water going to be bad water? <laughs> can we go stick a toe in it and see what I I suppose technically it's not touching our flesh anyway, right? So. Alright, 
so when it fully depletes, Sam can no longer bear his load. Be sure to break. Be sure to take a break before it happens. Don't be so so oh wow, oh, that's mad. Look at that feels insane, so Jesus. Don't be so I have no idea, Lucy. Pro tip, that is a shit house. Don't be so Is that my max of 120 kilos? Did I see SCR? Is SCR there? I didn't see SCR. How are you doing, fam? We've been going the right way. Just suddenly really realised I crossed the street, but. There is something hypnotically wonderful about controlling this character, and I can't really put my finger on it. <laughs> it just feels really good. <laughs> Jesus, good lord. How many animations are built into this dude, man? It's almost like I can feel every pebble under his boots. It's crazy, dude. Can we just keep going along the stream? Yeah, I think I think it's the music, Chantal. Oh, 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 careful. Careful, bro, careful. Oh, whoa, 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 holy shit, dude. <laughs> My god, they have not much about with a rumble in this. Bloody hell. I'm freaking controller just went crazy, dude. That is the strongest rumble I've ever felt. Wow, freaking hell. That's it, I'm going to keep a tighter grip on this thing. Oh, well, these are those uh, things, Lord. Should we see if we can grab some this time? So she was saying like one a day, right? Keeps the knobbers away. Losing too much loot can cause your movements to become sluggish and make it harder to keep your balance. Eating crypto biotes will rapidly restore your...
Fort of Grave Zero. He's like, he's got that. Uh, what's he on there? Is that the bike or is that? Holy shit! Okay. Getting your hair cut, Noblet. Good lad. <laughs> Get dog clippers on it, bro. Hey, is that a... Oh, cool. That looks awesome. I want one. Oh, super awesome. Bridges corpse disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. Not the touchy-feely type. Tuckerman said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges corpse disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. That just looks so cool. I'm gonna take a look. Oh, sorry, cheers, Blast. Seventh, yeah. He's got a date with the incinerator. How long since he flatlined? We don't know the exact POD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. He wasn't quarantined. Not sick. This is a suicide. Oh, Jesus. We're just lucky to be found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. Where are you taking him? Uh, closest incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with PTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. You put all that Kyrillium in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with dooms. Well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So that how does not sound Can we good. Count on you? Then Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. Just sends them. That's why we came prepared. A bridge baby, huh? With its help and you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. Seriously? Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. Freaks me out too. Whoa, what the f roll out? What the f what is that? Well, I know what it is, but what what is it for? different when I was a kid. Yo, Hopkins. America was a country. Anybody could go anywhere they damn well pleased. No need for couriers like yourself. We had highways, airplanes. Hell, you could even visit other countries. <laughs> oh, what the sp things coming out of the deep, dudes? As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. 
Then if you were lucky enough to survive, the time fall came and washed you away. And that's when folks started holing up in the cities. Couriers like yourself got put up on a pedestal. There's bitch. more doody stuff Rainbow. coming out of the doob dudes. How much further to the incinerator? This guy's about to pop. Shit. Rah! We're going to have to cut to the BTs. BB must be busted or something. <laughs> I didn't want to wear that. What do you mean he's bloody busted? Fix it! Creek. Crap. Oh, that don't look good. This is not going to end well, is it?
was going crazy. Just a walking simulator, Mario. There couldn't possibly be any other reason to play it, could there? <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's amazing. He, he was stabbing himself. I mean, whatever the alternative is, it's got to be pretty bad if you're literally sitting there stabbing yourself, right? Oh my god, that is so freaky. S stay strong, Baxos. Oh, the little baby! Those are. Damn, that looks amazing. Look at the whales. Oh, my God.
creepy nursery rhymes. Falling down land and bridges falling down my fair lady. Is that us? Oh. Sam is a repatriate, meaning that he can return to life from the place known as the sea when killed. In the scene, follow the strand to guide Sam's soul to his body to bring him back. The sea. Oh. Oh, what the? <laughs> what the? Oh God! What the fudge? What the hell, bro? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, 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 look, he's. Oh, that's nasty, bro. Is the baby still in there? there was an explosion a bang which gave rise to life as we know it and then came the next explosion an explosion that will be our last is that crater from what just happened when because they said something about it, it was gonna go boom boom didn't they jesus god so many questions the Odra deck can scan for cargo tags. Sam is a repatriate. Oh shit, I can... Sorry, I, I thought it was just loading screen. Wait, we're not... I'm not sure. I don't think I've got one in my stomach. I've got one in a box. Baby in a box. What the hell? And those tears are something to do with having the dooms, isn't it? Oh, you're awake. So, how does it feel to be back in the world of the living? Don't worry. Holy oh, shit. Well, a coroner, originally. You're up, Bob. Call me Dead Man. I'm well acquainted with the dead. Not like you, of course. Contrary to the name, I've never actually died. I would advise against that. 
I'm no expert, but I can assure you it's for your own protection. See? So I'm a prisoner. These aren't handcuffs. They're cutting-edge devices that keep us all connected. Us? Oh, us. Yup. Bridges. Humanity's best hope for the future. Or avoiding extinction, if you prefer. Right. Where am I? What time is it? Watch me. Try pressing it against your skin, like this. Relax. That just means your body's got a good connection to the cufflink. Look, look. The cuffs will watch over you 24 hours a day. That is to say, we will. We're here to help. Mm. What the hell? Two days. During that time, we took the liberty of collecting fluid samples from you. You're a repatriate. That makes you very special. What happened to the CD guys? Central Knot was obliterated in the Annihilation. Game over, man. The place is a crater. The only ones to get it continue were you, for obvious reasons, and your broken bridge baby. Is it all right? Uh, it's been marked for disposal. Didn't work anymore. Why keep it? Uh, we lost everyone. Not just corpse disposal. My team. HQ, all of Redford, every soul in Central North City. Bloody hell. We're at our base, in Capital North City now. Or should I say, our new headquarters. Sudbury seemed the logical choice. But our implementation team has been decimated. And there's only so much they can do in two days. Things here are a mess. Fortunately, the director and his support team were out of town at the time, so the chain of command remains intact. I hate <laughs> to do this so soon, but I have a job for you. Huh. Uh, uh, this stencil... Is from when you repatriated? Ah, what's the other mark from? A clingy woman in a cave. <laughs> mm, I see. Affenphosphophobia. No wonder you were out there alone, where no one could touch you. I'll try to be more careful, Sam. So, uh, the job is an urgent delivery. I need you to bring the president some morphine. What president? America's gone. You talking about the mayor of Central Knot? No, 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 no. Not the mayor. America lives on, Sam. The president is in the final stages of cancer, in critical condition. But there's still time. Why me? Look, Sam. Do as I ask, and I promise it will all make sense. Why don't you do it? Because I'm not really here. Whoa. Apologies. This is just a chirogram. And here oh, come the tears. Allergic reaction to the chiral transmission. I'm actually over in the isolation ward in the big triangle building. <laughs> ah, here is the morphine. Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Come on, you got morphine there. What's this about? Tell me the truth. Ah, the truth, Sam, is that America's last president wants to see you in person. Are you really about to say no?
very good. I'll see you in the isolation ward. This is crazy, dude. Bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. That is just madness. He, he don't muck about when he starts a game up, does he? Delivery order for Sam Porter Bridges. Request transport of morphine to isolation ward for immediate administration to the president. Beginning scan. Have a pleasant journey. So that, that crater was from the Boom Boom then, presumably. So, presumably... Bad Check things happen. Check the map on your if you're lost, Sam. The isolation ward should be pretty obvious. If you're not sure how to get there, you can set markers and draw routes too. Cool. Try it out and you'll see what I mean. Uh, open cufflinks to the map. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Uh, alright, so... How do I set... Place marker or plot route? So... Hold down... X and plot a route? Oh, whoa, dude. I'll do, innit? Morphine delivery to isolation ward. Uh, open menu. Uh, what's that actually look like? Map. Nah. Oh, wow, yeah, you can see it. Bloody hell. Capital not city. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's see what we can figure out. This is this is bonkers, mate. I have no freaking idea. What the hell? What's that? What's that? <sighs> oh, it says off limits. Uh, press LB to enter compass mode. Oh, okay. Um, so I think I plotted a shit route there, didn't I? So how do I get rid of... Remove marker, remove marker, remove marker. Okay, I think we'll just, we'll just sort of go manually, I think. As things are, Bob, you're all right, fella. <laughs> all conveniently uh, predisposed elsewhere, Advina. See how fast he can actually go. That's quite haunting, to say the least, isn't it? It's just so... Uh... I wonder what the fuck happened, dude. Central wasn't just home to Bridges HQ. It was also the seat of there the reconstructionist movement. If the president hadn't required special treatment, she would have never left. And if she hadn't, we wouldn't have either. What, the, uh, couldn't, couldn't be touched then, things, Missy? What was it called, Smyrna? Uh, Aphen... Aphenphesmophobia? Aphenphesmophobia? What all these off limits? 
but how we get access to those, presumably they'll unlock as we progress, will they, perhaps? Yeah, <laughs> giant PlayStation 5. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> there, there was a clue all along, Huffy. I like it, bro. You alright, Alison? You alright, Iceberg? Oh, you alright, Trump? Yeah, the Del Toro, yeah, yeah, that's as soon as I saw it. Did you notice he'd got like, um, all stitching around his head? But like his whole, I don't know if you saw it on stream, but his like forehead was like all scarred as if like the top of his head had been removed or something. Those uh, vehicles, they look amazing. I wonder if we get our bike back. You right, Jan? Like I said, her vital signs are all trending the same way. No chance of a recovery then? None that I can see. No. We should start making preparations. Sam! It's me, Dead Man. Sorry, my mistake. I'm afraid the President's condition has deteriorated. Thank you. This will help to ease the pain. And allow her to speak with you in these final moments. Her? The first and last female president of the United States. Surely you remember her. She raised you? You're not exactly dressed for a reunion. Take that off before you come inside. Right, okay, so... Oh, I see, oh, so we had... Okay, yeah, I've got him. Actually shows the route. That's really cool. Everything is awesome! Right, okay. Not too worried about all this at this point in the game, but I'm sure it'll... Uh... President's office, northern outskirts of Capital Not City. That's the president's right hand man, the director of bridges. Die hard man. Oh, you were with Bridges One? <laughs> so cool. Oh, I guess no introductions hard, are necessary. Man. <laughs> that is brilliant. What's it been, Sam? Ten years? Look at us. A bunch of deathless freaks meeting like this. Yeah, well, good to see you two. President's waiting. It's your mother, Bridget. She's a bit out of it, but I know she'll recognize you. Madam President, we've brought Sam.
you're doing all right. three years to cross. She's trying to rebuild the country. Still going on about that, huh? You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. Help Amelie. She needs you. Together, you you can help us reconnect. You can make America whole. Sam, if we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. We don't need a country. Not anymore. We do. Alone, we have no future. No, America's finished. Bridget, you're the president of Jack shit. Sam, listen to me. <laughs> you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. <gasps> Madam President! Oh, no. Doctor, we need your help. Listen, no one can know that the president is dead. If word gets out, Bridges is finished. Now, what happened here does not leave this room. Do you understand? Yes, Director. But there's still the matter of the body. Without corpse disposal. We've got that covered. Sam, before she died, the president made a contract with you. What are you talking about? As a member of Bridges, you're gonna work with the rest of us to rebuild America. You think you can recruit me? 
Like she tried to? Well, she succeeded. Look at your wrist. If that's not symbolic, I don't know what is. Director, the cancer spread throughout her entire body. Harvesting organs is out of the question, and there is no need for an autopsy. Her body needs to be cremated before she necrotizes. And if we don't, this place will turn into another crater. What do you want me to do? We don't have any porters right now. And the CD team you went into the field with are dead. But the president's body has to be burned. The road from Capital Knot City to the incinerator was compromised in the void out. And the only way there is on foot, through the mountains. But the chiral density there is off the chart. It's gotta be BTs. This job has requirements, tombs, repatriate. So me, why? Sam, you're already on the clock. Come on, Sam. Now get it done. Let's do Sam it. Sam Porter Bridges. <laughs> Are we going to actually take... Are we, we going to take the president's court? <clears throat> That's going to be fun. I, I take it I don't get a car. Oh, I like his suit. He doesn't, does he, sub quite? <laughs> Can I have a moment? President Strand believed in American Reconstructionism. She worked tirelessly to bring the nation together again. And without her, there would be no bridges. She deserves a funeral with full honors. But we can't give her that. If she dies, America dies. Without her, bridges will cease to be. Listen. Her cremation must be carried out with the utmost secrecy. Even if we pull it off, what then? Who's gonna take her place? Face it. America's history. Sam, America isn't dead yet. He just said that it dies if Bridget dies. She may be lost to us. But we still have an America worthy of the presidency. Sorry, what? Let's not get into it now. What matters is that we're going to finish your mother's work and rebuild America as she intended. That's the reason Bridges exists. So take the first step, Sam, and deliver the president's body to the incinerator. If we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Damn, dude, no way. Ask me bloody mom, mate! You're at Albany. Facilities to the southwest. Remember that you'll be passing through BT territory. We built the incinerator way up in the mountains so that the chiral matter in the smoke wouldn't reach the city. It won't be easy carrying a body up there. Well, we need to get the bloody roads fixed, mate. Well, maybe, maybe that's something that we can, but maybe that's part of the building. We'll be monitoring you around the clock. If anything comes up, we'll You're offer right, you support by the couplings. This is going to be a nightmare walking with this thing. It was bad enough just with a couple of boxes. Fuck you hell. <laughs> Talk about on your own, Sam. Good luck, mate. There you go. Slam the door behind him. Fuck you know, I've got to get a drink. <laughs> so, to answer your question, Plower. Sam. Whoa! Dead men explain how to use the cups, right? them to check the location of the incinerator. Damn, that is rough to walk like that, I tell you. So this is using... The base game is using temple anti-aliasing, as you'd expect in a fairly modern game. But it also has... If you've got a 20 or 2000 series uh, GTX card, you can use something called DLSS, which is basically deep learning super sampling. 
Um, if you don't have a 2000 series card, though, you don't really need to worry, because a lot of people talk about DLSS like it's something brand new. I mean, they're currently working on version 2, I do believe. But there's also something that's open source, which AMD use, which I think they call theirs Fidelity FX or something like that, which you can also use, uh, which also then has an in-game sharpening filter. So... Hopefully that explains that question. Right, just give me two minutes. I'll just be straight back. I've just got to uh, stretch the old leg. Two minutes. One foot right in front of the other. Why did he just sit down? What happened to the bloody body? <laughs> I only just got back in. I saw you lazy git. Massage shoulders. Well, that's it. Work it out, Sam. Work it out, bro. Oh, yeah. I like the hood. The hood looks cool. Did we get the body back? Do I have to go? Come on, back? What's on? That? Let's do this. Do I have to go back in or something? Right, let's, uh, let's get the hell out of here. So... Approaching cargo weight limit. Total rest 19 seconds. I wonder if that really does a huge amount. Let's, um... Hang on. Sam, I don't think I need to remind you, but every minute counts when transporting corpses for disposal. 48 hours following cardiac arrest, they go necro and become a fresh BT to make our lives hell. Oh, right, well, okay. Uh, what, do we know what BT stands for? I don't think we do yet, do we? Uh... Where, where the hell am I going? Let's, let's use the old Gingangooli button. Oh wow, look, it shows elevation and everything as well. How, so how the hell am I supposed to get over there? Uh, oh my god, it's freaking miles away, dudes! Um, all right, well, let, let's... So presume oh, it says out of limits though down there. Look, maybe I can maybe I can hang a hang a left or a right. <laughs> We're going from the, from the black tower to the big taco. <laughs> the big demonic taco is going to descend upon us. Oh wow! You are laid up here. Are you not having a good day then, uh, Alison? I'm sorry if I missed anything in chat. Is it not? Uh, is it not the best of times for you? Oh, I can feel. I, he can feel that weight on him, mate. He's. I tell you, it's ever so strange how he. Oh! <laughs> uh, right. Where are we going? Yeah, let's let's keep going this way. Then. You're right, Mara. We don't really know yet, Albaya, to be honest. It's uh, it's got obviously very deeply soaked in some wonderful lore, but I'm going to be honest as to what that is. I don't really know just yet, mate. President Bridget Strad was the symbol of American reconstructionism. Even with the country shattered and its people scattered to the four winds, she never stopped believing they could be reunited. People held on to their hope that America would rise again because they believed in her. We believe that this country can be rebuilt. America lives on, together with Bridget's undying spirit. Oh, wow, you can still move while you're doing all... It's like multiple input and everything. It's actually really cool. If I keep, uh, if I keep his hands on, 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 like, strapped up there, look, I'll take it off. That is actually very clever. Oh, come on, Jack. Walking singer. Did you think you're the first person in chat to say that today? Gotta to try harder, bro. 
all these wannabe comedians out there on Twitch. It's just it's sad is what it is, mate. <laughs> Caught with a new gag for fuck's sake. Oh, it's a fucking zombie simulator. I know, that's what I was thinking. These, uh, so it looks like when they go necrotic, like, I mean, when they go boom, they really do go boom, don't they? It's not a case of just like a little a little tickle of the pickle, mate. I mean, that crater knocked out the old of Not City by the sounds of it. So where are we going? Let's, uh... Yeah. I suppose this is probably... Yeah, oh, shit! Like Cock, sorry, Mum! <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, dearie, mate. God damn it, mate. That's mad. Man. I wonder if we can get like, uh, I'm going to assume later on, we get like, um, I don't know, like maybe an exosuit or something. You know, it helps us like maintain our balance sort of more mechanically than, than actually sort of wobbling about a bit. And so presumably we're going somewhere up there, are we? Oh, wow. Most of my hooch, it's clear to me. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Fuck me, that was incredible. I feel like a glass of whiskey and a cigar playing this, isn't it? Music's gorgeous. <laughs> Toss a coin to your witcher. Have I done something to trigger this, or is this, is this just what's supposed to happen? I should imagine we will. Well, I won't get DMCA because what I'll do is I'll take it down, Paloma. So, unless I get a live DMCA take there, which I don't think has happened to anyone on Twitch, so I'd be extremely unlucky if it was me as the first person. Wouldn't it? So, Gorgeous. No, I, I never picked her up, Mr. Bad Habits, no. I'd, uh, I'd heard rumours the PC version was very much a thing back then, so I thought, well, I can't remember what I was playing at the time, I wasn't desperate for another game, so. Oh Jesus, that's a bit deeper than I thought. <laughs> God, it's so weird. You can like, I really feel him struggling. It's, it's so good with the uh, the feedback on the Xbox Elite controller. It really is. Uh, anybody else getting static coming through? Not that I know of, John. It all sounds crystal clear, my end, mate. I hope I've gone the right way. I have a horrible feeling. I, I suddenly realise I've just like crossed the river for the sake of crossing the river, I think. Oh, can you? I did, I did, you know, I forgot about the radar, actually. Has he, got, has he still got that? Oh, yeah, he has. Ooh, what, what's that mean there? Oh, there's a ladder or something over there, look. I totally forgot about that, blower. Like, totally forgot about that. What's this? Oh, it's a crystal. Oh, wow, look at that. We're going to grab some of our uh, Cenobites, <laughs> whatever they're called. Your channel is anyone I'm getting it on. I don't know. I, I can't hear any static at all, dude. And unless somebody else can confirm. Is actually a ladder. It is actually a ladder. There's a ladder over the water, look. Oh, is this, is this the multiplayer thing? Oh, yeah, look, Igor. Is, is that like a, is that somebody, an actual player's place, the ladder down up there? 
Uh, how do we like that? Today's a good day. Oh, I got an achievement. Oh, it can be pressed repeatedly during the window. All right, okay, okay. I wonder how, uh, can I just walk across that or? Oh, that is fucking awesome. Yeah, it just feels so different. I'll tell you what, if you, if you do buy this on PC, you, you cannot play it with a mouse and keyboard. Oh, hang on, I just need to get this, guys. Right, sorry about that. Um, right, so what are we doing here? So, grab the rope. Give it some light. Now, what does this actually mean? Can I, I, I'm never going to be able to climb up there, surely. Or can I? Oh, Midnight Cat! Sorry, mate. It came through while I... So, sorry, I had my headset off. Uh, thank you very much for the 41 and the Prime. Darth, thank you very much for the 43 and that's tier 3, my friend. Thank you very much, Darth. So, how do you climb? Can can you climb? Okay, I presumably maybe not climb. Oh, fuck me. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, release the rope. Oh, he throws it back down there as well. Igor, where are you taking me, bro? <laughs> uh, oh, my God. Just a bit further now. I think it's just your end, then, John. That's kind of strange how it's only on one channel, though, isn't it? Oh, hang on. Shit, I didn't see that. Uh, press RB to use the terrain scan. Terrain surveys the area, blah, blah, blah. So, blue to yellow to dangerous. Oh my god, it just looks freaking insane. Is there, are these ladders actually here? Or, or is this is, is this Igor a real person? Or are you telling me this is just like sort of part of the tutorial like you were saying for Gonna have a look at the water like you were saying. God damn, that is that is beautiful, mate. Igor's a tutorial. Ah right, okay. Thanks for the help. Give him a, li a light, a light of likes, look. <laughs> Have all the likes, mate. So do I actually? Oh, that's sexy, sweet. Oh my God! Holy balls! That's a god ray, mate. That's a proper god ray. All right, this is a steep, steep climb up here, Mr. Igor. We ready for this? Reckon I can get up there. I don't think I can get up there. If I go round or give it a go. 
Alright, you're gonna have to put it back into this, Sam, alright? Be bloody careful. Good lad, good lad, good lad, good lad. Come on, keep it together, bro. Oh no, careful, careful! Oh my lord, oh Jesus balls. Just careful, careful, Alright, so let's have a little break, Sam. Let's have a little break, mate. Where are we going? Around there. Have a quick look at the map. We make, we're getting there, aren't we? We are getting there. <laughs> I can see the present ending up in, ending up in the river if I'm not careful here. I wonder how it connects you. I wonder how it works. Does it, does it mainly connect you with like your Steam friends? Like, say if I, I mean, I don't know how I would make a ladder. I've got no idea, but if I was to place a ladder down, there'd be a higher chance of my friends finding my ladder. Well, I want you to be very careful here, Sam. Yeah, if you, if you if you were to play this, you, you can't play this on mouse and keyboard. It, it would be a travesty. But there's so much awesome feedback from like things like the rumble and everything. I reckon I can clamber up there. Oh, careful, bright. So this is the incinerator. So that's the place, huh? It is. Yeah, they've, they've updated some of those graphics a little bit, mate. We've also got... With corpse runs, you now have to put your corpse on your backpack and carry it all the way back home as well, guys. Can you imagine like, if you were to take like like certain elements of different games, you know, like, like I don't know, like take take the uh, the insane geometry of like a game like this, mix it like with the combat of another game. I mean, Jesus, the, the future's looking pretty crazy, isn't it? It's like a little you can you can sort of play a little dance, sort of trying to balance it, a little, little bit of right, a little bit of left. Where you can sort of just like really get that center of gravity tied in. Ever so weird, the way it, uh, it just feels really fun. <laughs> it's weird, it's, it sounds bizarre, I know, but almost like a constant mini game. <laughs> that is not a shade or missy that I've kidnapped, no. <laughs> Cremate, place a body in the incinerator. Uh, order number three, top secret cremation, president's body. So we, we've managed not to nuke the area. Better than any 1080p stream you've watched, Gizmo, I can tell you that for a fact. anyway and now we've got dangerous things going into the environment so what happens Alas, he was a good soldier, Pete, wasn't he? <laughs> what 
note says. BB-28. It's the unit Igor was assigned. It was hooked up to you when we found you in the crater. But why is it here? Because it's flagged for disposal. No! Central Knot's gone, and our headquarters along with it. Because that thing didn't do its job. It's all in Igor's logs. No, I'm using Fidelity Effects. It can't be repaired. And it can't survive outside the pod. Pity it if you want. But the decision has been made. It has to go. The director approved the order. Does. Yeah, yeah, totally, dude. We turn to the capital, not city distribution center. We've got to go back where we uh, are. Cautiously. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, he just put his hood up, look. So it keeps, it keeps, keeps the direction of where they are. Look, Odra Day. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, it's scary, mate. There's things out there. Oh, Jesus, there's hundreds of them. Hold breath, hold breath. What, what, what? Oh, God, what? <laughs> We'll take a deep breath if I uh we'll just try and come around them. Oh, 
Oh, it's spinning crazy fast. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, it's horrible. You're right, metal fan. Oh, here we go. Walking simulator. I think we should we should time people out for that. Just because it's so boring there. <laughs> Thanks for the host, Anastasia. Thank you. Oh, not good. Not good. Bad call. Oh shit! Oh really bad call, bro. Oh really bad call, bro. Are oh, they actually looking for? Oh shit! Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Millions of the bastards! Oh, I've made a terrible mistake, mate. Oh my lord! Oh, oh, oh! That can't be good. Oh, that can't be good at all. Oh, dude, you've made... Oh, God, you've made a terrible mistake, bro. Get off me, nobbers. Get... Get... <laughs> get, get off me, nobbers. Get out of there, Sam. Get out of the... Get out of the goo, bro. Did we do it? I think we did it. I think we did it. Oh, mate, that is... That is nightmare for you. That's like, remember I was saying, what was I telling you about my nightmare? Remember that recurring nightmare I used to have as a child that I was telling you about? A long, not so long, mate. It's, it's not that far removed from that, really, is it? <laughs> this is like the worst game in the universe for someone like me. Let's get the hell out of here. I think we're all right. I think we just get the fuck out of here, bro. Let's go. Let's get out of here, Sam. Look at look at all the all the skanky ass freaking fingerprints and handprints all over it. Oh, enemy encounters produce a rush of adrenaline and rapidly restores stamina. Your stamina drops quickly once the rush passes. Oh, okay. In your canteen. Let's have some monster monster energy. Beautiful. Oh, I love all the uh, the hand marks on him. That's 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 creepy. <coughs> God, that was terrifying, mate. Does it want me to actually do this? Mm. Mm. Said said Norman Reedus. Mm. <laughs> it's about a few words. Mm. Mm. They did. They touched my bum bum. And, and my face. Right, we're out, we're out of the nightmare fuel, whatever that was. So we need to go back down. So I've come a really long way round, unfortunately. <laughs> so I think what we'll do is we'll, we'll set a waypoint there, a waypoint there, and a waypoint there, yeah? Let's go. Let's get out of it. Woo! What, what, what else have we got access to then? So we've got the stamina bar and presumably some sort of health bar. We've got... I'm not sure I totally understand the stamina element. Was that was that monster energy replenishing the little bit that maybe was like almost like seven days degraded a little bit? I've got camera mode. What's this thing? Oh, what the hell? Urinate? <laughs> no way. But is that... Is that... Be, be considerate of leave yourself away from other people and their property. Use LT to ready, you know. All right, hang on. Let, let me uh, let me go and have a way over the edge. Is that for real? Can I actually have a piddle? <laughs> <laughs> Got to be done. Got to be done. Right See off the, the edge, crater. mate. That's what's left of Central North City. Bring it too close, mate. Bridges HQ two. Careful, Nothing careful, woman. Careful. So how do I do this? Uh, LT to ready.
<laughs> oh, that was fucking amazing, dude. Oh, you left you left a mill in your bladder, Norman. God damn it, dude. Oh, I feel so much better already. Oh, that's beautiful. That's awesome. Game's got everything, mate. I'm saying I don't want everyone bitching and moaning about. Ah, so he actually unzipped his flies and everything. I wonder if those uh, handprints stay persistent or if the rain will wash them off. Ooh. What? What? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, what the fuck? What's going down, bro? I don't think he can have a poop poop. Maybe, maybe we, maybe that's DLC. Maybe we can get some poop DLC. I'd be up for it. I'd totally pay for it. See the plants sort of like growing and withering lot. Picking up on some. It's picking up on something. What's it? What's it got? Can you go pro? Oh, dick, dick, sticks and balls, mate. Fuck. Fuck. Don't say fuck, fuck, fuck. Gotta get, <laughs> gotta get an achievement for P, did I? <laughs> and we'll come right, right the way around from them knobbies, I reckon. Right, let's have a little look where we're going. So we want to... Let's get rid of that. And... I wonder if we can get around... I think we'll stick with the original plan. I think if I can get up there... Look. Seems to be going all right, don't we? It's all that bloody monster energy you keep drinking. Blake, Blake, Blake needs a waz, mate. <laughs> No. I can hear the little, the little baby stressing out. Oh, what the fudge, bro? How am I going to get through there? Oh, shit. I think... Oh, God. I don't know what to do, guys. Should I give it a go? Should we just see what happens with the troll? Oh, it's going freaking ballistic, isn't it? So it's going to take a deep breath in a minute. Oh, no. I might have made a terrible mistake. Holy balls, dudes. Fucking out of there, bro. I'm fucking out of there, mate. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Didn't really think that through, did I? Can I get down? I don't know where to go. There's freaking demonic entities everywhere. I need to be down a layer. Oh, mate. I've proper buffed it, haven't I? I don't know. What do you think? Do you reckon you could get down there? Ooh. 
That, that looks like it's a lot further than it looks, doesn't it? You know what I mean? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that feels mad. Oh, careful, 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 careful. One little jump, one little jump, just a little jump. That's, oh, yeah, like a freaking pro, dude. Look at that. Skills, mate, skills. Uh... Could be, could be, you might, you might, you might have to on your ass here, Norman. That's it. Keeping that center of mass. Oh, look at that. Pro skills, look. Woo! That's it. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> he just made a hand and waved. <laughs> That's cool, man. Looking good, man. Looking good. So, it's all the way down along the river, isn't it? If we follow the river... Uh, yeah, just follow the river. We should be okay, shouldn't we? Is there anything else I need to be worrying about? The stamina's okay. We've got the monster energy drink. Didn't it say something about that would fill up over time? Like it, it was using like, whoa, 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 using like resources or. How does this work? Do I literally just walk off the edge? That is actually really cool. Cheers, Idol. You're a star, mate. Yeah, I mean, that, that's all we know, isn't it, Flora, with regards to the baby? I mean, I don't... Oh, something's beeping. Oh, it's his hat, his helmet thing. It came off. Music is so good. Definitely uh, a glass of whiskey and a cigar kind of game, I tell you. Yeah, so without without the baby, we couldn't we couldn't see anything. It's probably the best way to look at it, uh, Mr. Bad Habits. The, the character, obviously, Sam. He can sense the BTs, I think they're called, which are like those whatever they are, demonic-looking things. Uh, but he can't actually see them. But with the baby, he can see that kind of outline, if you like. He's like, he's obviously jacked into, I don't know, I don't know how it works, but. That's pretty cool. Uh, I thought I would go this way along the riverbank. How far in? Oh, just, just not at all. Oh, for God's sake, that freaking virgin media thing. I deleted that like five, that's five or six days I've deleted that and it still keeps coming up. Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we've been streaming today, mate, so, I mean, I, I think we're still very... Oh, whoa! I just... Oh, Jesus, that proper yanked me then. Bloody hell. See the way he put his hand out on the rock as well. Yeah, just, just we've been playing for about, I don't know, about two hours, mate. Still very much prologue, I think. Check the water flow. Sorry, blow up. It's going after about six hours. Yeah, I mean, everything just feels very tutorial at the minute. I, it's, it's one of those really weird things. I, I think um, th there's no way to really articulate what, what it feels like to play because there's no other game that's done anything like it. It's it, and it's going to sort of, sort of almost make it sound like you're trying to justify your enjoyment because you can't understand how it feels to play it unless you've played it. Um, th this isn't just a character where you s 
click the stick and moves forward. Uh, well, my, my, my best advice to anyone is do not play this with a mouse and, and keyboard. It, it, it would be a catastrophe to play it with a mouse and keyboard. Um, the, the, I, I don't know, again, I can't really explain it, but using the controller with, with the rumble and everything, the, there's kind of like this sort of instant dynamic feedback, which is really hard to explain. There's something just really fun about making this person move move forwards. Um, who, who knows? I mean, I don't know where else the game's going to go. I mean, obviously the cinematics, the uncanny valley nature of the, you know, the characters. I mean, the mocap, the facial mocap, it's stunning. The story's like intriguing. You know, what, what's going on? It's, it's a big, what the hell? Classic Hideo Kojima, really. It's... Uh, it's going to be one of those games that is so easily slated, but actually, if you if you actually bother to play the game, maybe you'd you'd understand something more about it. Now, I'm not saying the game's brilliant or anything at this point. It's still way too early to know what the hell's going on, but there's something actually really pleasant about playing the game. And what else can you say? Do you enjoy it? Yes, I am. There you go. End of story, right? It's ever so weird having a character like this. It's going to seem so wrong going back to like a third person style of game moving a character around where there's no sense of momentum, weight or center of mass shifting. It's freaking crazy, dude. I'm literally watching, you know, when I'm climbing around, watching where his feet are and feeling him move. And, you know, you can sort of tap the L and R, B, but, sorry, the, the, the trigger buttons to sort of like to change that center of mass all the time. It's ever so strange. Really, really. This is something I didn't think I'd be talking about, to be honest. Right, we'll grab these. I think they're important, aren't they? The cryptobiotes. That didn't take long to get back down here, so it starts to feel a little bit more, a little bit more at peace with it. What's this here? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All clear. Welcome. Sam oh, right. Porter Bridges. Use to select and select structure menu. Structure menu. Where's oh oh here's in, here's something interesting. Look, I didn't see all of this. Look, carrying capacity, resistance to falling unconscious, lung capacity, rugged terrain. Oh look, it's got like RPG elements. Oh wicked, did oh so you can really pimp out old uh, old Sam then. So we can go up and down on this menu. So we've got Watchtower, Sam. I'll tell you what, the heads up display is fucking gorgeous. It really is absolutely freaking gorgeous. Uh, right, so it says materials required to upgrade. Is, is that like a player, is it, or something? Well, what would I want to... Allow you to survey... So has someone placed that, but we can't we can't do anything with it because it's not actually fabricated as of yet. Is that right or? You're right, Miss Group. E exactly, Oz. E exactly. And it's something different as well. Fucking hell. We're, so many gamers say, oh, we want something different. But something different comes along and everyone just like hates on it without even trying it, don't they? Not sure about that. You have to get closer to it, Loops. All oh, right, sorry, mate. Shall I just get... Ah, right, sorry, got you. Structure menu. Oh, it's the same thing though, dude. Durability, 98. Don't seem to have any options. You're right, T, how are you doing, sir? Use watchtower. Oh, wow. Jump to marker. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, you can place markers. All right, okay. So presumably, oh, look at that. Oh, nice. So when it, all right, okay. Well, hang on. Let's take this. Jump to marker. Cool stuff, man. So if I go to the structure hmm. menu and go to the watchtower. And it says metal zero out of 400. Is there something else we can do with it later on? Is there perhaps? Or... 
Let me just get rid of my other... Um, can I just delete all waypoints? Uh, remove everything. Let's crack on. So we are going... If we click that button, we know where we're off to, don't we? That's cool. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Smetanol. Yeah, the Kyra crystals. So yeah, definitely. Yeah. Welcome to Capital Not City. Proceed to distribution center. Sam. Come back to the distribution center. I'm coming. Check the I'm on my way, on mate. I'm coming, I'm coming. I think she's going to get in a coffee. What do you reckon? Should we get a nice, uh, a nice brew for the uh, cutscene? Because I'm, I'm going to assume there's going to be something happening. Yeah, let's go and get a coffee. I'm quite enjoying this. Uh, I'll be back in like, I don't know, just like two minutes. Not a moment too soon. Sam, you know how to get back to the distribution center? Hurry back. Old Sam's, uh, was he, having, oh, was he having a doze? He's actually asleep. Massage those shoulders, come work, work it out, Norman. Oh, look at that. Oh, cracking those. Oh, beautiful, mate. Okay. Right. Oh, thanks for, thank you for the bits, Iceberg. Thank you very much for the bits. And Midnight Cat, thank you very much for the 41 and the Prime, my friend. Thank you. Who else? We went Darth in with the 43 and the tier 3. Thank you very much, Darth. Yeah, I wonder, wonder if that affects anything. I wonder if, like, resting actually does, you know, help with stamina and things. But it's quite a lot of character RPG elements, aren't there, from what we just saw? It's a miracle either of you made it back. When someone with Dooms hooks up to a BB, your feelings and memories cause feedback, like with the speaker. It amplifies fears and stress and runs the risk of taking you to a place from which you will not return. I'm sorry, but this BB has been pushed beyond its limits. This also is the only option. No! Sam, get cleaned up and come to the president's office. We need to talk. Oh, 
Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. So hang on, is that the only way you can save then? You, you have to rest to save. So if I was to quit, or, 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 or does it does it still auto? Presumably it still auto saves, right? Look at that, I'm going all the way around and then all the way back, look. That's so cool. <laughs> I really like that. Uh, okay, so, awesome! So connection level, like some recipients and some sort of connection level. Okay, so four to grade five at present. Not sure actually, Daxos. I don't think I've seen that, so. Don't know what you mean, Pancreas. Are you talking about, uh, you talking about seeds for Alpha 19 or something? Or? Sam, I thought I told you dooms and BBs were a dangerous combination. Huh, perhaps a shower is in order. You're still covered in chiralium. Oh, that's what it was, Daxos. I want the president to see you like that. The hell are you talking about? She's dead. <sighs> You're upset. Is this about BB-28? Go fuck yourself. I'm not your errand boy. <sighs> well, in any event, it seems it owes you its life. No, we owe the kid our lives. You too. As you say... I shall look after it. Give my regards to the president. Oh, little baby looking at us then. Yeah, that chirality, that's what happens when we burn the bodies, uh, Daxos, it, it, and obviously it's dangerous. It brings in uh, BTs, doesn't it? So we, we probably still it's had some from the incineration. Here. It's a dream catcher. I wondered what that Wear was. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. It's a good looking game, Metal Fan. It really is. It's uh, pr pretty impressive, mate. Some very interesting tech behind it as well. Good morning, Sam. Sam, this is Di Hartman. There's a private room set aside for your use. Bridges perk. Take a moment to clean up, wash all that chirelium off, then come to the president's office. Chirelium. <laughs> we can take a shower. Uh, use toilet standing under construction. <laughs> is that is that something we have to unlock? Is it? Or? That shower looks fucking awesome. Bit of Reader's butt. Oh, the toe, dude! Clean the toe! Oh, that looks proper manked. <laughs> that? Can you hear me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Dr dream seeker, Missy. Dream you sweet seeker. Oh, uh, no. Except for taking a shower and going to the toilet, that is. I take it you were getting your 
office opening up. Good. Come to the president's office as soon as you're done. She's waiting for you. I didn't see the baby flip the finger, no. Did he? I was watching him, he just looked sad, like he was, oh no, come back daddy. <laughs> You did well, Sam. Thank you. Bridget may no longer be with us, but her legacy has a chance to live on. Sam, listen to me. I love looking America, at like on Cheers. Reconstructionism. Her dream isn't dead. I don't want to hear it. This is the face of our new hope. Our new America. What the fudge? Homily. My mother may be gone, but I'm here. And you, Sam? You're here too. Been ten years since you saw each other, right? And in all that time, she hasn't aged a day. He knows why. My body's still on the beach. I don't get to grow older. But you do, Sam. You look good. So you're serious then about reconnecting everyone and everything? Someone has to succeed Bridget, Sam. More importantly, someone has to carry on her legacy and see our country rebuilt. Samantha America Strand, our new president. A new beginning for our people, for our nation. Under Emily's leadership, we'll reestablish the UCA, the United Cities of America. This is how we'll rebuild our country. But we'll need your help to do it, Sam. No. I'm through with this. I said my goodbyes to all of you when I said them to Bridget. We never forgot about you, Sam. God damn it, Sam! You ran away. You cut us off. Emily put together an expedition. The best of bridges won. And went west. territory. I kept them safe while they searched for survivors. Never once missed a BT. Saw him coming a mile away. We convinced community after community to join the UCA. And we left behind our own people to help them. It took us three years. But we managed to make it all the way to Edge North City. All the way to the Pacific. Jesus. Yeah. But then everything went to hell. The team was wiped out, and Emily was taken. Taken? I'm not being kept in a cell or anything like that. I'm allowed to use their facilities and to speak with you whenever I want. I just can't leave the city. It's all to safeguard the continued independence of Edgenot City. Well, that's what her keepers are saying, at least. They want the UCA to leave them be. Emily's their insurance policy in case we don't. Who are these assholes again? Homo Demons. Militant separatist group. They run Edgenot City. I've heard of them. Wow. Bunch of terrorists who go around towns killing people and leaving craters. Right. Nothing's off limits for them. Not even engineering void outs. Whoa. You think the suicide that took out Central Knot was one of theirs? Could be. Shit. They're extremists like the demons everywhere. Plotting in the shadows. They're decentralized by nature. 
No one organization to rule them all. Just a common ideology. I know not everyone shares our vision for the future. If we Americans don't come together again, humanity won't survive. I carried my mother's message to people all across the country. But not everyone was willing to accept it. More than a few would rather stay isolated. Keep to themselves. Go it alone. Like you, Sam. They think that America can only be rebuilt by force. By men who tell them what to do. Who take away their freedom and put them in shackles. What'd you put on me, huh? You know better than the demons. Just another kind of cult. They're not shackles, Sam. They're a symbol of our bonds. That's what we need right now. Not to stand apart, but to come together. To form chiral knots and reconnect. Sam, we want you to go west and finish what Emily started. The people she left behind have been hard at work, setting up chiral network terminals. But these terminals are still isolated. We need you to bring them online. And for that, you'll need a Cupid. This contains all the necessary security and operations protocols to integrate a terminal into the Cairo web. Take the Cupid West, Sam, and reconnect the people of our great nation. And when you get to Edgenot City, find Emily and bring her home. After that, I'll take over the presidency and carry on Mother's work to save the country. This was Bridget's dying wish. This is how we'll move forward. Please, Sam. We need you. I'm Sam Porter Bridges now. I'm not a strand. Hell, I'm not even part of this outfit. You all saw to that. I'm not getting involved with you or anyone else ever again. Wait! See? It's like I'm not even here. Same as it ever was. Sam! Sam! God damn it, Sam! She looks so sad! Hold on! Stop! Listen to me. America needs you. Both of you. Yeah, covering the world in cable didn't bring an end to war and suffering. Don't act surprised when it all comes apart if you try to do it again. Round and round it goes. Connect, reconnect, it's not that simple. All right, all right, Sam. Just take it easy. I get it. You don't have to commit to anything now. Why not get some rest? Good idea. We all need our sleep. Leave it too long and you're liable to reconnect with the other side. The necessary maintenance has been completed. Various adjustments and fine-tuning for your benefit. You can use Stop it again. Stop shaking the baby. For once, it would seem that Dooms and BBs are a good combination. Aww. Hello, little baby! <laughs> well, perhaps the two <laughs> of you have something nose. of an ability for one another. Aww. Oh, it's beautiful. He might have been a scarred or something to be timeful, perhaps Lady Elvira, not too sure. Might, he might have a, a bit of a haggard face maybe he wants to hide. Damn, that just looks so clean and crisp. Yeah, it's that lady. Hey, you Sam. Sam just got an eye full then, didn't he? Cheeky boy. Listen, you are Sam Strand. No, not, not anymore. My name is Sam Porter Bridges. It's 
a funny word, strand. A strand is part of rope or bond. While stranding means being washed up on the shore. And being stranded is when you can't go home. I'm stranded now, Sam. Here on the shore of the Pacific. Thousands of miles away. But our bond still holds. You're free, but we're still connected. Don't tell me we're not. Fuck me, that looked real for a moment then. Fucking snap out of it, boy. <laughs> Jesus. Come back, Sam. I'll be waiting for you. I didn't know that plural, well, thanks for that. That's interesting to know. So Norwegian and Danish for beach. Ah clever stuff, mate. And look at them veins in his arms. I think we should get a Sam, this is Die Hartman. You were out like a log. Must have been beat. Private rooms come with all the basic amenities. Shower, toilet, etc. Drop in when you need to rest. Inspect your gear, review info, or whatever else. If you have any questions, feel free to ask our staff. But before you do, why not check things out for yourself? See how Bridges operates these days. Examine figures. Who said fi Oh God, oh Jesus God, fucking hell, dude. Thought it was coming for me. Spooky McSpookerson. Whoa! <laughs> That's really weird, dude. Whoa! It's coming at me, bro. Uh, I don't think we need to. Should we leave that alone? else can we have a ganders at? Use the sink. Wow. Form action. Oh! <laughs> I took a picture of the back of his head. <laughs> <laughs> BB liked that. BB liked it. God, look at that. That's amazing. Damn, that is freaking crazy, dude. Uh. 
It's like, it's like he's real. Maybe he is. Maybe he's real and I'm not. That leaves the rest of you fucked completely. Use the toilet standing. Sam Hartman here. Is it a shower toilet? Oh, that is so cool. Secrets of the beaches and the Death Stranding, as well as those of dudes and repatriates. When you relieve yourself, a certain amount of chiral matter is flushed from your system. Oh. Chiral matter can adversely affect hormone secretion and nervous function. There's a correlation between exposure and the development of phobias, as well as, in extreme cases, violent and suicidal impulses. Chirelium contamination has even been postulated as a trigger for the onset of dooms. Allow me to collect a sample of your excretions for my studies. Feel free, man. They provide mate. a non-invasive means to monitor your exposure to Chirelium and your overall health. Chirelium. Okay. Uh, pop a zip. That'd be mad, wouldn't it? Imagine he squeezed, squeezed a little blackhead out. I'm gonna have a poop. I think I need a poop. <laughs> Boat, a bike, noise. I like it. Very clever. Ten out of ten. <laughs> Would poop again. All right. What else have we got in this room? Weapon rack. Hey there. Believe we've met. I oversee delivery operations as well as maintenance and repairs. Nice to have you on board. I'm Mama, in case I didn't mention it before. Hello, Mama. Those there are strands. Not just used for packing, by the way, but for identification, too. Take a closer look and you'll see. See the red there? That's your blood. Well, what? You want what? You want Mama Mama? Mama Mia. Ooh! And there she goes again. Uh, uh. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh, there's BB. Looks like we have a... Check on, check on BB. Oh, it's good. I look a little BB. Hey, little BB! Sam, this is Deadman. Oh. I calibrated your BB based on physiological data we collected from you earlier. It's still just a best guess, though. After you take it out for a spin, we can check if you're in sync and tweak the BB sensitivity as needed. BB looks quite happy. Soothe, BB. Hey, a little fella. Hey, a little, little fella. Oh. Do it again. Do it again. Hello. Hey, a little one. Okay? Do it again. Hello, little babies. Daddy. Oh. That's the equivalent of. Tap it on the fish tank. Leave the goddamn baby alone, Grum. And then I think we've got equipment. Was it equipment? Examine the equipment, right? This case will remove any chiral matter still clinging to your suit. Uh, speaking of suits, uh. blue is for delivery personnel. Red for medical. Orange for corpse disposal. Oh my! Right. for security. Forgotten all of that already. <laughs> Blue was for security. Orange was for corpse disposal. Yeah. Black. Something else. Uh, so you can change the color scheme. Oh, no way. Has it got loads of customization options as well? Holy shit, that's going to be cool. Oh, dude. Oh, you can change the lens as well. Oh, look at that. That's proper bish bash bosh, mate. 
Oh, we'll, we'll leave that until we get some more. Alright, and then let's leave that. <laughs> Thanks, chat. <laughs> I'm just so lost right now. It's just like so much going on. Uh, activate terminal. Oh, shit. I reckon I could have had some monster then. With that terminal there, you can browse the bridge's database, which has info on a range of subjects. You don't have clearance for everything, but there's still plenty you might find informative. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Right, so what's this? Um, so that it looks like we've now... Is that BB Happiness or something down there, look? We've got red, which is our general health. Blue, just stamina. And the orange one, haven't we? By the looks of it. Um, so... Uh, oh, I can't seem to click on anything there. Let me just see if I can get that monster drink. Uh, activate terminal. Prepare to make it. Oh, oh, hang on. Open the menu, which we don't want. Got some sort of music player. Is there anything I can actually do here? I don't seem to be able to do anything. Let's just make sure we've uh, checked everything out. We've checked out the little figurines, haven't we? Checked out the sink and the poop shoot. So is my active one the one on the right-hand side, is it? So if, if I leave now, presumably I wear the blue one. Is that right? Which is the postal delivery. Orange for corpse, black for security, red for med uh, medical. So leave private room. Let's see what happens. Ooh, it's die hard, man. Well, have you had a chance to think it over? Chock full of Chirelium, but safe for you dooms guys to wear. Now it's well, all you need good. to go forth and reconnect the world. To make us whole again. I'm a porter. I don't care about connecting anything. Or making knots. But I'll do what I have to, to help Amelie out. Hmm, this coffee's going down well. It's a fun game to uh, swig and drink to. There's a lot going on. Nice glass of whiskey. Listen up, Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they pass through on their journey west are called knots. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Ooh. Right now, it's only capable of transmitting voice communications. Sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small amount of data. So, unless the necessary data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Anyway, all you've got to do is find the knot, connect your Cupid, and bring chiral communications online. Once this you is connect freaking it to awesome. the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you will connect us not only to each other, but to our past. All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Looks like we've got attach points on our shoulders as well, Lord. 4.6 billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. 
Once you God, establish so current cool. communications, generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use chiral printers. It won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Mm -hmm. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. Stop shaking the baby! The at the dispatch terminal. Make sure you check it upstairs. Drops waiting up there too. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. All right. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. It's got a little, uh, look, it's got a little space man there, look. Hey, oh, baby! Ooh, scary baby. <laughs> Pretty much Torbs, yeah. You up, Mornington? I'm sorry. You up, James? Norman Reedus, uh, Lady Elvira, I think is the actor's name, isn't it? Norman Reedus, like Plo says. It's been quite a few, uh, quite a few things, though, hasn't it? Oh, good luck, James. Good luck, mate. So, Smetano, you wanted me to have a look at something. Can you remember what that was? Uh, I'll tell you what, just bear with me one second, Frank. So I just need to have a little bit of a wiggle for my back, so uh, my back's playing up. Yeah, I wasn't sure about that blower, because uh, when he smelled like the strand, the rope, didn't they, when we first were asked to investigate the suits, didn't they say something about blood was incorporated into it? I was not sure I entirely understood that. Sam, this is Die Hartman. Your current objective is to extend the Cairo network from here to Portland City. But don't think you can make a beeline straight for it. Signal won't carry that far. To cover the distance, we need to utilize knots. Think of it like uh, tying ropes together to make a longer rope. The first of these knots is a bridge's way station. Go ahead and take a look at the order. Deliver whatever they need and connect the Cupid. Private locker. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. So take on. That's Nick Easton. Orders available one. 
Okay, take on orders. Orders for Sam. Take on orders which Sam services in particular have been requested. Right, okay, so that's west. Cargo condition less than 50% damage. Smart drug delivery. Way station west of Capital Not City. Uh, open route. What does that mean? My god, there's so much information, isn't there? Uh, I think we will simply uh, listen to the briefing. The last void out in Central Knot City brought deliveries to a standstill. Until now. Your cargo for this run is a batch of smart drugs. Oxytocin, to be precise. Oxytocin is effective at reducing stress, so much so that some folks call it a love or happy hormone. Once you've completed the job, connect the way station to the network using the Cupid. Okay. Sam, order summaries may contain information critical to your success. Make sure to review them before getting underway. Okay. All right. Lots and lots of things going on, many of which I have very little understanding of right now. But we shall... <laughs> I'm, I'm going to take... It looks like there must be small, medium, large, and extra large container packages. Um... So it, oh, so presumably that, that those little icons are presumably BTs, vertical climbing, risk of falling, and river or water traversal. Uh, so we've got the order summary. We have... So the way station west of Capital Knot City is the first knot in a chain that will eventually span America. You need to deliver oxytocin, boosting smart drugs to ease the stress of bridges staff working there. Okay. Smart drugs. Supplements that provide the brain with oxytocin and other hormones. Effective at easing symptoms known to arise from having little interpersonal contact. And, oh, we've been given... Oh, we've got... Oh, does that mean... Does that mean We've actually been given those. Four ladders and a climbing anchor. Cool stuff, dude. Uh, accept orders. Oh, what the hell? Carry on back. Attached suit. Carry by hand and offload. Uh. Sam. Gosh. We've supplied you with some rope and a ladder for this run. They should help with the steeper inclines, and the ladder will also make a halfway decent bridge if you need to cross a river. Right now, I figure you're thinking about how you want to handle this order. So to access the cufflinks, it allows you to decide where and how to carry your cargo. How well you balance your load will, be, will affect your ability to walk. Okay, makes sense. So I need to load... So presumably... Oh, hang on, tool rack. Attached to suit. Holy shit. Climbing anchor, hang on. Where shall I attach that? Oh, I think I think I'm a bit lopsided. <laughs> I think I might have done terrible things here. Uh my god. Here you go. Fucking hell, this is mad. I feel like a super soldier. Not carried. Auto arranged cargo. So should we see what auto arranged cargo does? Your current load will be optimized. It's not that much different to what I had, or is it? Oh, it is. Oh, he's, oh so he's got... Oh, left and right. Ah, oh, 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 right. Oh, so he's dis oh, I see. Ah, right, yeah. That makes sense, actually. All right, so confirm. 
Head out. Yeah, let's do it. All right, that, that's actually taught me a couple of things. He looks like a badass. Check this dude out, mate. My postman don't look fuck all like this. My postman's a lazy bastard. Holy shit, that feels amazing. Oh, wow. It feels so different. Oh, wow. Oh, that's madness, bro. I, I, I feel heavy, dude. I feel proper heavy. Oh, I love it. All right, let's head out then. So, so hang on, this man. Where, where's this codex you want me to look for, mate? Sam, triple check your loadout. I take it. Open the tool heads up display. Oh right, okay. So, this, oh wow, okay. So we've got lad, we've got four ladders. Hole that is driven into the ground creating an anchor point for a thirty meter rope that allows for ascending, descending of steep slopes and cliffs. LT to ready an anchor, RT to place it. Okay. So how do I just... So I don't want to do anything. Let's, let's get out of there. Wow, that, that's crazy. That's actually really bonkers. Um, so, we want to be going up there. Now, that, that... I have no idea. I mean, should we try and traverse around on the flat area rather than going back up through the incinerator. Is there any way to get rid of this? This Why have I got this path marked? How do I get rid of that path? Or is that just... I mean, I'd like to see if we can go from there over to there. God, this is mad. Uh, Where's that waypoint marker? How do I see the waypoint? That away. All right, let's go. There's somewhere on my cuffs. I've forgotten how to look at my cuffs, dude. How do I do cuffs? Hello. 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 <laughs> Not that then. How do I look at the cuff? Name Sam. Uh, cuffs. I've got the map, dude. I don't know about cuffs though. I've got that as well. Check on B. Oh, look, check this out. Check on BB. Check on BB or not, dude? Oh, BB, hello, little fella. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. <laughs> map info. Uh, some map. Where's info, dude? Oh, car. Oh, check and adjust cargo orders, data, view tips, interviews, your activity log, and more. Uh, tips won't be in there, will it? What are you? What are you actually after me trying to find out, dude? Can't see anything, mate. Oh my god, what the hell, dude? There's so much stuff here. The Odra deck we know about. BB. Choosing where BB's voices, uh, voice comes from. Repatriation, deep water, holding your breath. Holy crap, bro. So, I can't see anything. I can't see anything obvious. It looks like we've got other menus that aren't open yet, though, smart enough. So, maybe later, mate. It's a bit bonkers, isn't it, Lady Elvira? Left on the D-pad when looking at the map. Yeah, yeah, we've done that, haven't we? I, th I think you were trying to find, like, a sort of index, weren't you, Smetanel? Have a pleasant journey. Sam, you see that sign someone left over there? Oh, you can where? leave some of your own if you'd like. Messages, warnings, words of encouragement. Whatever comes to mind. Oh, I just saw that. How did we do that? I just saw how to do a sign. L, B, and Y. Uh, <laughs> this is so cool. Um, good work, BB. <laughs> Keep on keeping on. Nick Easton. 
Get some likes, Nick. All right, let's, let's head out. All right, here we go. This is it. This is the big one, all right? Yeah, I'm, I may be willing to lock it in a... Yeah, it's sort of like you couldn't have a bestiary for some games, I suppose. I, I need I need to have a wee-wee, actually. Let's have a quick uh, peep behind this rock over here. Eh? So these are other packages, are they? Oh no. Nick, e Nick, Nick Easton was the... That, that's not a player, is it? You can pee on the purple rocks to make them grow? No way, what, for real? I don't like the look of that water, mate. I really don't like the look of that. That looks bloody deep to me. Nice one. Good tip that pullover. Oh, huh? yeah, this I'm a pro mate, I'm telling you. Like a pro pro. Yeah, 28 kilos, yeah. Keep it up. Keep this it is up. freaking cool, man. I can actually feel it, you know. It's really weird. You definitely need to play this with a controller. There's, there's, there's just no way this would feel right with a mouse and keyboard. So if I need a pee, I need to pee on one of those... Um, Cenobite rocks, as I call them. Not, not that they actually are Cenobites. I seem to think that's something to do with Hellraiser. But. So good luck today, James. When's uh, is it anytime soon? Your uh... <sighs> holy shit, dude! Stamina restored, fatigue level reduced. Where are we even going? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. What, where where are we going? I just suddenly realised I I'm sort of just picking up random shit here. Uh. I think we start walking that way. We don't just want to carry everything, do we? Oh, nice one, James. Cool. It's, it's so strange. Like, like he feels completely different to how we did earlier, you know. <sighs> 37 kilos. Neat. Totally changes how we uh, go through the water when you change that center of mass. So we presumably got. Can you actually zoom in on those? A post box? What's a post box for? Disc based media, 1.1 kilos. That doesn't weigh a lot, does it? How you doing, Sam? Yeah, well, we had a bike at the start, as so I don't know whether we get... Um, there were some, like, really nice cars, uh, is how I described them. I'm not sure whether we'll, uh, we'll get anything like that. Yeah, if I, I sort of hang on to the... the straps like that, you, you can actually... It's, it's pretty, uh... Pretty mobile. Okay, 
can let go. So it's only 1.1 kilo, so I think we'll grab that. Let's see what he's like. At that. Ooh. So what, what's this for then? Thanks for the help. Deliver lost cargo. So should I do that? Uh, structure menu. Don't want that, do we? Activate terminal. Make delivery. Delivery. Uh, deliver requested cargo and cargo dropped by others. I'm a bit confused. Does that mean I don't have to go all the way over there, or? So sh should I use this, or, or, or am I supposed to actually take it manually? I'm kind of not. Oh, okay, Lizard. So you start one in a new place. It started as a mushroom, and as more people pee on it, it grows to become those rock formations, which... Oh, I see. Oh, that's cool. Good work, Sam. I see you brought in some lost cargo. Feel free to submit it here for processing. If you come across any more while out on a run and don't think you can carry it to its destination, you can always put it in storage. It'll be safe and secure until another porter comes along to finish the job. Oh! Even if it has to pass through a dozen more hands before it arrives, you can rest easy knowing you did your part. Oh, so it's so... Hang on, I'm confused. So all this is doing is just storing the lost cargo safely. I don't know. Well, I'm not sure whether I should just take it with me. Is this not just simply just offloading it? Best to leave cargo for places that you are not going for so other people will send it. All right, let, let me let me come out of this, I think. Let, let me come out. How would I know where my... How do I have... A, God, so many buttons. Uh, let me just have a look at my cargo again. How do I access my cargo? Not that one. That's hold breath. Um, open menu, cargo. Does it say where it's all going? Does it actually tell me where it needs to go? Lost cargo. Uh, I'm I'm a bit I'm a bit confused. It all seems to be linked to someone called. It says Nick. It says destination down bottom right. Capital not city. Is that where I'm actually going, or it's not? Is it? Because I'm actually going to the way station west of Capital Not City. So it looks like the lost cargo is actually at Capital Not City, doesn't it? Is that right? And that, of course, is Capital Not City. Ah, and it says pieces of cargo currently carried one. I'm not sure. I'm not I'm not sure I get that. Pieces of cargo currently carried one. I don't know, Anzi. I don't know whether to just quickly nip back and see what happens if I take it there, look. It's saying uh, return disk based media. Return tableware. Return disk based media, look. Which is back that way, isn't it? But what happens if I take it? I don't know. I don't know where to go back or not. <laughs> I mean, I could just pop it in there. And then somebody else can pick it up or maybe we could pick it up even on the way back right um how do i access it so activate the terminal um deliver requested cargo and cargo dropped by others deliver cargo dropped by other porters so uh if lost cargo is taken to a facility other than its intended destination the following options can be selected and trust or store, submit the cargo at the facility and trust its delivery to another player and return its content to its original owner. Don't do anything. Do not submit the car cargo, keeping it on your person in order to deliver it yourself. So 
So select multiple. Yeah, my bad. Why are these now? Why are they? I'm confused. Okay. Wow, level level ten. Not sure what it just seems weird. It seems like I swear I had some other stuff. So select multiple, select multiple. There you go. I think I put two into the don't do anything category, didn't I? So that's good then. So although we basically we, Nick Easton must have dropped a load of cargo, so we may have just sort of sort of popped into the post box so it doesn't get lost. And then we've still got our gear to take to that western outpost, haven't we? So hopefully that just means we're a little bit we're a little bit lighter on our feet, aren't we? Yeah, that's better. We're back down to normal. Right, so we need to crack on with our uh, delivery. All right, that's actually pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, I get it, Dark Wolves. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, presumably you get some nice uh, bonus points out of it and what have you. Now, I'm still really struggling with all the different buttons I've got. Where's my waypoint? Uh, I mean, if we, I reckon if we head down there, pretty much, it looks like a fairly simplistic route, doesn't it? There's another post box over there. I don't know what, that's presumably where we're going, is it? Yeah, but we're going to go around, not up and over, I think. So how do you gain in your character statistics? So like here we saw movement speed, balance, rugged terrain resistance and all that kind of stuff. How, how do we gain in that? Do you just literally just by playing the game, do we? And you reckon that if I have a piddle on this... <laughs> crypto buyouts. Shall I... Uh, how do I do... How do I do Tinker Winkles? Yeah. What what are the plants? What are the indigenous life of the uh the nightmare fueled planet we're on? Is he whistling? Oh storm setting in. Not good, mate. Sam, remember that prolonged exposure to time fall damages cargo containers. Don't stay out in the rain any longer than you have to. Oh. Oh. Uh Oh shit. Oh shit. How do I get out? Oh fuck. How do I get out of the rain? Oh my god, that looks insane. How do I get out of the rain? Can I find a cave like we did at the start or something? Or... I'm not sure what to do here. Well, I don't like it. Is there anything on the map that will like. Find a cave? Yeah, but how? I'm worried about going off the beaten track, Mario, you know what I mean? I can end up, like, just travelling and not going in the direction I want. So is this actually damaging my container? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, no. Is this knobbers? Is this knobbers? Have we got knobbers coming in? Oh, what the hell, dude? Ah, oh, shit. Where are they, BB? Help me out, BB. What we got? Oh, mate, they're over there. Millions of them. Millions of them. Oh, right, I've got them right in the middle of them.
What's that up there? That's some sort of chiral thing. We don't need to worry about that, do we? Oh, I'll tell you what, it's freaking spooky, mate. I'll tell you. Not sure yet, bro. Uh, I don't know what time it's going to come on. I know it's supposed to be delivered tomorrow, but... Better be careful with the breath, because if you... Oh, oh no! Okay, because BB seems to be... Oh no, BB's picked up on something else. Oh, God damn it, man. I'm going to be right on the water's edge here as well, aren't I? I'm going to pick those ladders up. I think there's a little... Uh, it looks like it's a little slightly... So it's like the river's a bit narrower up there, isn't it? It's like we've got BBs or BTs behind us, haven't we? In. We even going the right way. <laughs> Can we just check them out? Uh, I, bizarrely enough, we actually are going the right way, which is a freaking miracle, let's be honest. Uh, now, can I get across that water? It doesn't look too bad, does it? I'm going to have to stand up and sort of... There we go. Got to, got to hold on to the straps when we do that. That's so cool. DB's still not happy, is he? Ah, that is so cool. Terrible mistake. Reckon I can get over and climb into that rock there. And climb onto that rock. Oh, I'm about to right F this up, aren't I? Let's, let's hold on to our... Oh, that does not look good. That does not look good. Right, let's catch our breath there. Can we try a ladder? Can we try one? Uh, how do you use the ladders? <gasps> Not like that. Uh, ladder. Oh, cool. How would I... This is actually really cool. Fucking awesome. <laughs> uh, you can collapse the ladder as well. Can you, can you take it? Oh, that is so cool. Uh, yeah, we've got the scanner. Can I, can I pick the ladder up now? I reckon if I hang on to my... Can you not, can you not pick it back up now? Oh, dismantle ladder. Uh, do I, did that just get rid of it? It doesn't come back into my inventory. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have done that. Ah, eh? uh, sorry. Dismantle literally means dismantle, not, not just pack it away. 
Ooh, got him, got him. I think I think I made a terrible mistake coming around here to be honest. It's gotta be a bit careful. Are these rocks actually gonna be more dangerous because it's wet as well? You know, if I come in when it's a bit drier, will it be a bit easier? That's so neat. Uh, we've seen some, but I think it's still kind of tutorial, to be honest, Rob. So I think I think the stuff that we have seen from other players are already there, placed NPC-wise, I think. And that's where we're going. Look at that, then. Oh, gorgeous. You're right, West. Have I seen a whale? I've seen a lot of dead whales, mate. Hmm. But we could probably just, uh, I mean, I've got three ladders, so I reckon we can just stick a ladder down. Because presumably once we get there, that's it, right? I I don't really want to be uh, using all my ladders constantly, but we might as well... I reckon that's actually out of the water. <laughs> they are so cool. <laughs> There's something really cool about that. I don't know what it is. Right? It just tickles my pickle. It really does. So then if somebody else uses that, they can like it. And presumably that, that maybe helps me get some points. He, he f you know what's really weird is because he's got so much gear on him. He actually feels a lot more stable. It's kind of strange. He's got a real weight to him there. Um, and obviously momentum-wise, you can definitely feel it. But because he's got that weight all distributed around him, which we haven't had before, and this isn't even a huge amount, he actually does feel technically center of mass, especially when I do that and actually hold on to the... Uh Yes, I'll tell you what, it's fucking clever, you know. Yeah, no, you can't retrieve the ladders. No, the, yeah, the ladders, once deployed, that's it. You either leave it or you get, um... That is, I tell you what, this is such a good looking guy. Hello. Name's Sam. So cool. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. No, no. Uh, that's, uh, we've got all our cargo still. Yeah, in fact, how would I check that out? If you go in there, go to that, you can check the cargo. So we've got the, we've got the oxytocin on the back, which is the primary delivery, haven't we? And all the other things that you can see are actually my ladders, my anchor, and another ladder. And we've also got the boots. On the boot clip, and we've got our other boots. So yeah, the three things you can see. My, my, I've only got one actual prime delivery, which is the oxytocin. It says, so you can see the damage. It's not actually been damaged, but the container itself has taken damage from the, from the, the time fall, right? So what happens if container damage itself hits 100%? Do, do we then start taking time full damage to the primary cargo? Or, or does it just simply mean it's more delicate? I'm, I'm not, it, it was kind of a bit vague on that, wasn't it? Yeah, because I can actually move the drugs, say, down to the floor. I can attach it to the suit and put it on my left leg look. Right hip changes will be undone. Undone, what do you mean? Oh, I didn't actually confirm it. So let's go back in. So if I wanted to go to cargo, uh, move to suit right hip. 
Oh, then you have to confirm, presumably. There you go. So now I've got my primary cargo on my right hip. Oh. Excellent. Um, the container isn't important. What's important is the content. When the container gets fully damaged, the content starts to suffer. So it, it's almost like a shield to the cargo, is it? You right, pacify. The cargo has box health and the cargo health. Cargo health is immune to timefall damage. Oh, no, cargo health is immune to timefall damage. When container health is gone, cargo is still, still fine from timefall. But that, that's the way I read it, Smetanol. Yeah, so is that, that's in contradiction to what you're saying, those Zed Flames. The, the, the way the game suggested it was that timefall damage... destroys essentially the container but timefall can't damage the cargo but it essentially made it much more brittle um, more prone to physical damage from falling over things like that yeah okay so yeah yeah so so yeah so so basically if i if i was to i mean let, let's put that in context right if i was to be out here right and i just stayed in timefall for an hour what are you doing sam the cargo itself isn't going to get damaged, but the container would be completely and totally uh, corroded, essentially. So as long as I then walked back in there without taking any fall damage, we'd be fine, right? Cool. Cool stuff. So, Private Locker will make the delivery. Deliver requested cargo. The smart drugs. Oxytocin. All cargo required is ready to be delivered. The order can be completed. And confirm. Oh, you can get a spray to repair containers. Ah, oh, right, cool. I didn't know that. Thank you. We've all been feeling the loss of Central Knot City. No one seemed to know what it meant for the organization. Or the UCA. Or us. The oxytocin will take the edge off, and that'll be a big help. Won't be long before we're back on track. We may have a look. This is great. Thank you again. Yeah, everything looks to be in good order. And soon our way station will be too, I hope. Nice. Excellent. Wonder what this connection level is, then. Is that... Is that something to do with this uh, chiral network? <laughs> I love the fact it gives you your route like that. I really like that. I don't know why. Just have a little look of where... Look at that. Look how far we go. That's so cool. Uh, difference between new delivery route and the shortest route. Everything is awesome! Next. Level 11. I know, I'm, I'm doing alright here, Mario. I'm not falling flat on my arse yet. I have a feeling I'll probably fall off a cliff or three by the end of it. <laughs> You're with the second team, right? Where are the others? Others? Dead. Caught in the void out. No way. That one blast got them all? And what, they just sent you out on your own? I mean, if it was just a delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through from time to time, but... The second team was meant to bring the Cupid. They were going to connect us up. Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years. Bloody hell. And they sent us one guy who was... All right. It's Norman Reedus, mate. Shit. <laughs> Tell me you brought more than the Oxy, at least. Oh, um, God, the Cupid. You... Really? So it's true. They finally got it working. Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid? We've got a long way to go.
All right, here we go. The following structure can now be constructed using the PCC. So we can make our own post boxes now, can we? New options have been added to delivery terminals. Fabricate equipment, make delivery, share locker, share locker with door cargo. Donate weapons and equipment. Oh, there's the ladders that I placed, or, or I think. Possibly. Or, uh, and maybe other people's as well, because they look like ropes, don't they? All oh, right, yeah, enabling you to see and access other player structures, yeah. Oh, look, it's all cleaned up now. You can see him on the hologram. Connection to Capital Not City confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised. We can finally do what we came here to do. Hey, you're headed west, right? Gonna be a lot of people happy to see you. I guess you'll keep on until you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie in person. Oh, that's something. That is really something. I... Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Well, anyway, you best be careful on the road. There's some bad people out there. More than good, some say. <laughs> but I don't need to tell you that. Thank you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Knot City. Right. What's next? West of the way station are a couple of structures our previous expedition put in place. And beyond them is your next destination, Fort Knot City. It's on the shore of a crater lake that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up Fort and Capital Knot. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Makes sense. Given the distance we need to cover. We're looking at using a distribution center and a power station. As cool. to which you should head for first. Start with the distro center. Yeah. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Perfect. I like it. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Roger. I'm, I'm getting into this. Good this work. is fucking awesome. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Do they? Or <coughs> fabrication as well. Thanks to <coughs> Excuse me. In network capacity, HQ is now in a position to provide you with additional materials and support. Should prove useful. All right. So weapons and equipment can be fabricated using materials provided by facilities. The amount of materials available at a given facility will differ depending on the facility type. Okay. So let's have a look at Fabricate before we do anything else. So it, I've got some sort of materials here. So I think, I'm not sure what the 552 is. The 1020, I think, was metal, wasn't it? Was it metals or something like that? Um, so let's click Fabricate. So, oh, right. So ladders are actually, oh, no, zero. Oh, no, hang on. Uh, that's interesting. It says required zero available. So it's resins and metals. Well, I suppose what you have to take into account. What's a PCC? Yeah. You can use that PCC to build a post box. So PCCs can be used to build structures, but be aware that doing so will use up some of the chiral bandwidth available to you. The what what? Structures can be shared with other players once built. Post boxes can can be used to return lost cargo and trust cargo for delivery by others. The share locker function can be used to exchange weapons and equipment with other players, and the private locker function can be used to temporarily store personal cargo and equipment. Okay, I think that all makes sense. Um, how many ladders have I got? I've, got? I've only got two ladders now, haven't I? Yeah, that, that yeah, it actually tells you more. Um, so if I was to make that, how many do you require? A ladder that can be folded down into a compact form for transport, but it is 10 meters long when fully extended. 10 meters it can serve as a makeshift bridge when laid horizontally. Oh, this is sodding awesome. Uh, we'll take, we'll definitely take that. We'll just, well, maybe two. I don't know actually. <laughs> I suppose if you have three ladders plus the rope, that that's your four primary hip and shoulder slots, isn't it? And then primary cargo on the back. I think I will make another one. Uh, confirm. 
Oh, right. So you could, I, I could make like one of those and three of those and then click confirm to bulk construct. Makes sense. Fabricate this equipment. Yes. Excellent. Uh, carry. Where should I really be carrying all these ladders? Attach the suit. Attach the right hip. Let's just see what happens if I do auto arrange cargo. It seems to like putting it over there, doesn't it, for some reason? Let's just go confirm. And let's get these other deliveries. <laughs> An ISP postman. Uh, take on orders. Orders for Sam. Take on orders for which Sam services in particular have been requested. So we've got rare metal uh, rare metal delivery, 30 kilos, and something to do with... Let's listen to the briefing. So that one's a no-brainer. Let's just have a listen to it. You'll be delivering supplies for a Cairo printer. The distro center you're going to has one. First expedition set it up. On its own, it's no different from your run-of-the-mill 3D printer. Connected, though, it can utilize chiral network data to reproduce cool. all kinds of things. And you can imagine how handy that might be. Now, I know I don't need to tell you, but steer clear of any BTs you find out there. A void out's the last thing we need. Sam, it's Hartman. Void outs occur when the living of our world come into contact with beached things. Oh, well, that's what BTs the are. The is similar to what a physicist would call an annihilation. When a subatomic particle collides with its antiparticle. Alas, there ends our Beached things. Why do the dead transform into BTs? Why are void outs only triggered by human contact? And why are people like you able to return seemingly unscathed? No one knows. Yet it cannot be a coincidence that these phenomena were observed only after we discovered the beach and bridged this world and the next. Anyway, to reiterate. The only reliable means by which you can prevent a void out is to stay far, far away from BTs. It, it, it's very good, Tin Table. It, it's only surpassed by the amount of people that come into chat and call it a walking simulator. We will take that. So what's this post box then? Do I have to go and make Sam. one, do I? you're in the middle of a run and decide you need to secure your cargo temporarily or entrust it to another porter, you'll want to make use of a post box. In addition to cargo, post boxes can also be used to share gear and weapons, if you're so inclined. Now, I'm sure you've used them before, but humor me and build one. Okay. Maybe between Capital Knot and that way station. If you're lacking a PCC, I'm afraid you'll just have to scrounge it up yourself. All right, so I'll need to, if I take the quest. So I need to actually make one of those. To use a PCC. Yeah. It goes without saying, but if you're not already carrying a PCC, you'll want to fabricate one. So if we grab that, how much is this? So 32 resin and 40 metal. So it's not it's not too bad. So it stands for a portable chiral constructor. Allows you to build various. It's almost like a little mini 3D laser. All right. Well, when we get there, we'll figure it out. So let's let's make one of those, then confirm it. Is it? Do I have to put that somewhere as well? Uh. Holy fuck, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> uh, oh, what the hell have I done? Oh, what have I done, guys? There we go, there we go. So have I got have I got my PCC? Yeah, so we've got the ladders. Yeah, okay, there we go. Phew, Jesus. I thought I'd made a right botch job of that. Yeah, it's been safe, it's been alright. So, uh, 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 I'll tell you what's in table. The, um, 
the visual fidelity of it, mate, it, 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 it's Sam, staggering, bro. you've got your PCC in order, head to the site I designated to build that post box, would you? You should have no trouble finding it if you check your map and compass from time to time. All right, let me ju I just want to check something. So if I go back in here and go to open menu and go back to my cargo, I just want to see what is actually on my back. So th this is uh, so that's all that stuff. So it's actually quite heavy lot. All right, OK, all right. I'm, 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 I'm confident. Uh, just give me two minutes. I just need to uh, have a stretch of the old back one sec. Okay, so let's so we're heading down. Where are we going? We're going down there. We want to get about halfway to drop that post box, and don't we? So I think if we kind of come along there and maybe look at a crossing. I don't know, somewhere around here, possibly on the shoreline along there. Maybe. What's that? Post box construction site. What's that? Destination post box construction site. Oh, I, oh, I actually have to... Oh, do I actually have to do it at exactly the exact spot for the first one, do I? Or not? Or have I misinterpreted that? Because that, that's back over there. Oh, it won't, oh, sorry. It wasn't... Oh, sorry. I was thinking it was between Capital Not City. Oh, and the distribution centre. It actually wants me to backtrack up there, doesn't it? Is, is that right? I think it is, isn't it? It wants me to do the post box back there. So let's go and do that. Get rid of a bit of weight. You can see the uh, the dream catcher. It's got the dream catcher on the back. Look. Oh. Weapons Oops, sorry. Restrictions lifted. Weapon usage restrictions. Wonder what the uh, wonder what the wonder how that plays a role in it all. You are Uncle Oz, how you doing? So the coral bandwidth is how much you can build. The better connection rates of an outpost of the area, the more you can build. Okay. There's my there's look, look, look there's other people got ladders down, look. There's two ladders down there. One of them's mine. Might as well stay on this side of the river then. Freaking crazy, bro. We just have a little uh, how do I check how do I check BB? Actually that's a good question. How do you check BB? Oh uh <laughs> Oh Jesus mate. Yeah, how did you, how did you check BB? It was here, wasn't it? Uh, check on BB. Oh, look at a little tootsies, mate. Oh. Yeah, not too bad, thanks, Oz. Yeah, I'm quite quite intrigued by this, mate. I will tell you what, it's, uh, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go down. I don't know whereabouts is that on the map. Let's have a quick look. Because it looks like it's kind of in the middle, doesn't it? So, if I cross... Yeah, if I cross on the ladders here, we're in the right area, aren't we? Ah, look at the old grumble ladder. Oh, who's this one? There's someone called Suki Yaki. Tell you what, Suki, I'm going to give you some thumbs up, mate. Just for having such a genius idea as me, bro. Thanks for the help. 
Today's a good day. Today is a good day. The player base working as one. There we go. Can you like your own ladders? <laughs> I'm gonna assume not, right? Right, come on in, Norman. Let's pick up that pace, mate. Everyone's uh, doing the same things, though. This one's for you. Thanks for the help. It's all right. Good stuff. So it looks. So how? Here's a question: How am I actually getting resin and metal? Does anyone know? Oh, he says as he sees a load of resin sitting on the floor. Now is that a delivery, or just pick it up and what's that noise? So, what does that mean? I don't get that. Do I, do I just have to deliver it to get access to the resins? It's not It's not telling me I need to go anywhere. Approaching cargo weight limit. I thought I, thought I could have it to 120 kilos. Stash it in your private stash. How, how would I do that, mate? Oh, maybe that, maybe it's going to show me. Mate. Maybe this is how the post box works, then. Sam, keeping on. I see you've arrived at the designated site. Good. When you're ready to proceed, activate your PCC. Use it to build a post box within the area I specified. So, PCC. Uh, how do I equip it? So, it's going to be like that. Oh, whoa, check that bad boy out. Adjust the construction location. So, we'll pop it in there. <laughs> Holy shit, yeah, that's cool. Fish bash bash at a dig dag do, babe. Okay, so we got likes. Distance traveled. Awesome! I swear he's on a bike there. I, I reckon we'll. I reckon we might get vehicles. That after my last one fell off a cliff. Good work, Sam. That's a fine looking post box. If you access it and select share locker, you can share cargo and equipment with your fellow porters. Deposit a ladder and a climbing anchor, and I'm sure someone will eventually come along who could use it. Got enough supplies. Why not leave some behind? Be right by others. They'll be right by you. I don't want to give anyone my ladders. I like my ladders. Oh, my stuff's getting damaged, isn't it? While we're out in the uh, while we're out in the time pool, I just suddenly realised. Uh, so how do I do this then? What do I do here? Share locker. Place items into. Sam, you can use share lockers to exchange cargo with other porters. Okay, you can also choose to claim items. Okay, so I'm gonna... Well, obviously there won't be anything to claim. So donate weapons and equipment. So if I... If I take... If I pop in, say... A ladder. Place in the share locker. And what else did it want? It also suggested I give it a climbing anchor as well, didn't it? And then we'll come out. Oh, cancel. You need to confirm, don't you? You will not be able to reclaim any cargo you place in share lockers. So you can't take your own stuff back out then. Is that is that what it's essentially saying? Yeah. 
So what's the private locker? Play signs in to remove them from a private. So, so is that where I'm supposed to? Your private locker can be used to store cargo and the like. Oh wow! So, oh, so that, oh, so that's how you can store things, but it has to go into the private locker. So I could put. So if you wish to reclaim them, you have to do so from the specific terminal you use to store them. You can check what items you have stored in which locations via the cufflinks. Right. Okay. So we don't want to be doing that just yet, then. I'm going to assume... Yeah, look, we've got all that... Yeah, my, my, my cargo is getting damaged in this freaking time for a lot. So, I just picked up some resin. How do I get access to the resin? Do I have to deliver it to one of the outposts before I can use it? Or okay, can I go back to the outpost and like get new containers, for example? God, this is mad. Oh, that's a very poor ladder, sir. Gosh, it's not, it's not like my ladder. My ladder's out of the water, bro. Very amateur. Ladder placement. There, there you see? There's a difference between these port. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pro porter. Look at that in the distance. What's that thing over there? Look? Oh! Careful, sir. I need access to a crafting printer. What, to get the resin? So what, can, I, can I not just go back in here then, no? And, dr and drop off my resin to bank it? Or, or is that not how it works then? Let's go and have a look. Rolling thunder. Yeah, we might as well, um, I wonder if there's any other options, like, someone said there was, like, a spray you can use to repair cargo containers as well. Ah, oh, so it's so cool the way it, like, stretches out when he gets there. Um... Right, obviously no orders, no delivery, share locker place, items in to remove from a share locker. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to make myself one of those. And we'll make ourselves another ladder. Oh, hang on. That didn't work. One of those. One of those. Confirm. Fabricate. Now, if I do load all and then auto arrange, it seems to have a pretty good balance all things considered um so let me just see so if i come back out here now go back into my menu for cargo i've still got the 80 resin look so should i just keep going because obviously i've not, not been able to deposit that have i some of these have taken... Uh, we've got 14% damage in that time fall. The resin's already damaged, obviously. Um, right, so let's... Let's head down. So we've ultimately got to get on the other side of that river, haven't we? I think what we'll do is we'll head down and we'll kind of... Oh, what's that? Online sign. Mules. What does that mean? What are mules? Are mules bad? Get rid of waypoint A, don't I? Where's waypoint A? Why are you over there, dude? Get out of there. Uh, you didn't stick it in the private locker, but you can take it with you to the next place if you want. What? So, uh, so I can put it in the private locker then? Is that what you're saying? And then that that banks it, does it? 
So private locker, resins. Playing some private locker. Confirm. Don't, don't really get it. Still, still don't have access to it, do I? I suppose they're. Can I access them from anywhere, or would I have to? I'm a bit concerned about this, Kaviji. But would I have to come all the way back here to access those resins? Or Weapons restrictions lifted. What is that down there? It's site specific. I still don't, so how do I access them then? How do I if I find resin out in the world, how do how do I bank them to, to have access to them for the PCCs, the Chimal Network, the construction? So this is oh this is one of those scanners, isn't it? Watch towers. Uh we'll give him some light. Today's a good day. This one's for you. And we'll use the watchtower. Let's see if we can. Uh... Got, we've got loads more resins. We got freaking out. We got all sorts down here. That's the route we're going. Oh, this is this is cool, man. Okay. Did you not? What was that noise then? What was that? Did you hear that then? What the hell was that? That, that don't sound good. Oh, what the hell, dude? Oh, wait up. What's going on? What's going on, baby? I'm actually really enjoying it. <laughs> it's nice to play something that's just different, to be honest, mate. It, it's just so unique. So, so that's what that was on the map. It's just someone saying, watch out, I guess, is it? <laughs> I don't think we can interact with those chiral crystals yet, can we? Oh, what the hell is that? Is that? Oh, that's actually. Some, oh shit, that's someone over there. Heads up, Sam. Your cargo's been pinged. Move now. My, ca my cargo's been pinged. Get to your what? destination ASAP if you don't want to get caught. Oh shit, that dude's coming after me. Oh fucking dick balls. Oh no, that's not good, mate. <sighs> will they go to the last known location or will they actually are they actually on me? Let's see if we can break line of sight and get the hell out of there. Do I need to pee, James? Do I? Really? How, how full's my bladder, bro? <laughs> Jeez, James. <laughs> yeah, get, get in here, though. In the, in the, in the bull rushes, look. I'll never find you, mate. Oh, what about if we do use the rope thing down here? Oh, there's one there. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. Tactics, bro. Oh, that don't look fucking good, mate. Uh, well, that, that could probably end really, really fucking badly. Um... What about that? That's, 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 that's got to be a good move, right? So can I have someone behind me? This is terrifying. Oh, there they are. They're down there. Look, you can see them. 
Oh, wow, what? Look, what a bloody ninja, mate. What a bloody ninja. <laughs> this is fucking amazing. Right, just remember not to press X. Yeah, they've gone to my last known location, but they're all... They're all uh... Oh, this stuff. What? Really? Oh, no. How did they do that? How did they see me, dude? Oh, I've run out of bloody rope. <laughs> oh, shit. I don't believe it, mate. Oh, mate, we need to get the hell out of it. All right, where are we going? I don't even know where we're going, bro. What are these things? What are these things here? Oh, what the hell? Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Whoa, dude. Slippy, bro. Slippy. Oh, they're right on me, lads. They're right on me. Whoa, what just happened? Yeah, suck it, nobbers! Suck it! Does that mean we're, uh, does that mean we're a little bit? It's a bit of a minimum. Okay, well, let's take a little breather. Uh, I think it's very important that we uh, urinate for James. So open your flies. That's it, sir. Uh, don't want to piddle in your seat. Right, let's, uh... What was that there? Oh, it does look, it does make a little mushroom. <laughs> Oh, this game. Uh, right, what am I doing? Map. All right, where are we going? So we're still... If we just carry on... Oh, what are these? What are these? Oh, more mules, look. Shit. I don't know whether to try and... Uh, if we cross here and maybe try and come around, perhaps? Oh, that water looks... That water looks proper dodge, mate. A piss shroom. I like it, James. <laughs> exactly. What are they, bro? I reckon we might be able to get across here. What do you think? Let's give it a go. Oh, that's not good, bro. Okay, see so stamina drop then. Holy crap. What's that up there? Luden's fan. What's that all about? Luden's fan. Oh, you can chain ladders together. Really? Okay. I fancy going and having a look at what and seeing what Luden's fan is. Can we see that on the map? Luden's fan. We're going to have a look, see what it is. Could be like a cave or something. How are we doing stamina? What's, hang on, what's this thing in the bottom left hand corner? Where, where, where my feet, my, my, my little. Is that. What is that? That's not like a health bar or something, is it? I don't think we're getting up and around there, so no. Shall I have, uh, shall I have some monster drink? I, I 
have a feeling we shouldn't be going up there. But I, I just can't help not go and explore. Boot wear? What, are you kidding me? I've got, a sweet, oh, I've got a spare pair of boots on me though, haven't I? Oh shit, I did not know that. So I have boot durability, do I? Cool stuff. Oh, what's this? Oh, what's this? Oh, we can get we can get out of the rain, maybe. Gonna open the door. We're not dead. Hey, novice! Is there no way in there? Hello? Anybody home? My name's Sam. God damn it. Weapons restrictions lifted. Oh, I thought it looked good. Careful, careful. My cargo is gonna be mullered. Climb on top of it. What, really? What, is that a legit Huffy? Is that something I can do? How would I do that? With the ladder? Really? <laughs> God damn it, bro! I thought I was going to get like a little trap door I could drop down and have a nice cup of tea Weapons and a biscoff. Yo, I pickle pee. How you doing, mate? Let's have a look on the map. Where are we going? We got a long freaking way to go, yeah, ain't we? I want to try and stay away from those mules, but I guess the mules don't come out during the time fall then, though. No? Keep it together. Slow down, Sam. <laughs> okay, Huffy. No, no, cool. No, no, thanks for letting me know. I, I didn't even think about trying it. Like, God, that looks fucking amazing. Seriously, it's got to be one of the best looking games ever. Oh. Well, that, hang on, how persistent are things? So like, let's say that ladder, I've placed that ladder, right? Does that ladder remain persistent as long as I am? Whoa, what the fuck, dude? Oh, God. Don't, don't say it like that, bro. What's that? Pick up? Pick up what? We go down near the shore. Ooh. Yeah, it is very, it is actually steve -o. It, it's it's one of those it's, it's very I, I can totally understand why you know it, it's had such bizarre mixed oh shit I'm walking right through the middle of them in I
Yeah, that's actually a really clever mechanic. So essentially what you're saying is that the ladders will remain even if I log out, but ultimately everything does disappear over time. Oh, shit! I just let go of my whole breath. Shit! Oh! Not good! Oh, I've made a terrible mistake, lads! Jesus, Paul! I'm so sorry, BB. You can hear little BB stressing out, man. BB is not happy. Oh god, Jesus, I've got the damage. <laughs> oh no, what's the matter? Oh, BB. Something wrong, Sam? Oh no. BB's dying. Uh, nothing to worry about. Its functions are temporarily suspended, but they can be restored. I can perform the necessary maintenance at a distribution center. Hurry, though. Oh no, little baby, he's suffering from autotoxemia. What the hell? Did, did I do something wrong? Did I did I put him under too much pressure? Oh, I'm so sorry. I feel oh, I'm, a, I'm the worst dad ever. Autotoxemia. Ain't, ain't no one needs. Oh yeah, I think time falls disappearing, so we can probably run now, right? I'm gonna save you, BB! It triggers the production of harmful compounds, and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. Don't worry! Called autotoxemia. If your BB's not performing the spec, drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Ooh, was that a bike? I'm gonna save you, BB! Come on, Sam! Come on, fuck the bike! Save the baby, bro! What do I do? What do I do? Private. Rest in private room. Uh, should we make the delivery first? Just get that done. Uh, delivery. Yeah. Confirm. Come on. Chop, 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 Sam! Ooh, fancy. Waystation folks told me all about you. Sam Bridges. With the second expedition, right? The guy expanding the chiral network on his lonesome. What he's not out making deliveries. So what'd you bring us? Let's see it. Talk about above and beyond. <laughs> Thanks. Must have had to pass through BT territory to get here too, didn't you? Bloody did, mate. <laughs> they weren't joking when they said you were a legend. I'm, I'm still not sure what I did wrong. Was that was that just part of a tutorial? Uh, I mean, why why did Phoebe get so stressed? Because all I was doing was holding my breath, right? Does that does that starve Phoebe of oxygen as well? Everything is awesome. Connection level two star, ooh, three stars, nice. Yeah, was that was that part of the tutorial, Zed? So that, that bit there. Oh, well, I see. Um, there's loads of ways to get those uh, ranks up then. Okay, it's time. Do you mind connecting us to the network? Sure can, sir. Let me just get my uh, my iPod dangly bits out. 
Those things are awesome. Alright, cheers, Kaviji. Coverage. We're getting there. We just got to get all the way over to the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> I don't like the look of that middle bit of the map with all them big black circles either. That can't possibly be good, can it? Sam, as always, thanks for bringing more folks into the UCA. That's all right. My pleasure, mate. So as more facilities join the... What's that stand for? The United Cities of America, right? Bridges HQ will be able to provide additional functionality to those facilities, such as the ability to fabricate equipment and weapons via the delivery terminal. The range of available weapons and equipment may increase, and new terminal functions and information may be added as things progress. Okay, new interview data acquired. So this is... I think this is what you were talking about, Smirnoff. Oh, that's, that's what BB stands for. Bridge Babies. I don't think I actually knew that. What was the BT? What was the BT thing? Something things. What was it? <laughs> uh, beyond things or something. Mail and data. Yeah, this is what you were talking about, Spano. And a new option has been added to delivery terminals and recycle. Oh my god, all the things, bro. I don't even know what that all means. Looks like we're on the chiral network. And with those materials Beach you brought thing, for our chiral printer, we can produce supplies for you here as needed. Think of it as our way of returning the favor. Now head west and keep on doing what you do. Yeah, will, mate. Top banana. Good. The distro center is on the network. Sam, do me a favor. Take your BB to a private room and connect it to the incubator. Right, Jack. Good work. So presumably do that from here, do I? Private lock. Ah, uh, no. Rest in private room. So what does recycle do then? Uh, recycle cargo to produce new materials. Thanks for following, Mel. And Rumpel. Dead man, you there? Come on. Help. Okay, Sam. Remove the pod and connect it to that incubator. Oh, BB's upside down. It's in. Good. Uh, a temporary excess of stress. Easily Aww. address if we return it to its mother's womb. Mother? Hey, what, what? Uh, located in the capital, not city, ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother? Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. And you, in turn, connect yourself to a BB, granting you the ability to sense BTs. Holy shit. Fucking what? <laughs> These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. BBs need to believe they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a still mother via the chiral network. Oh, wow. Baby! The update is in progress. Right now, the pod is synchronizing with the Steel Mother in Capital Knot City and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data. That is pretty cool. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. That being where it technically belongs, of course. Oh, you look so sad. Hello! Hello, little one! I'll try adjusting the acid dosing package. 
autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. Uh, you should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. Uh, okay, sorry. Each one has been it's physically so removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. But his little wiggly toes! No on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. And then, you're saying there's no way to keep my baby alive? <sighs> You must what? understand, there is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we expand the chiral network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why the BTs might be reacting to your blood. I spoke with Hartman. I forgot about We should have your results soon. Anyway, get some rest. You and your BB are both exhausted. We are. <sighs> it's terrifying out there, mate. Good night, Sam. Thank you, bro. Oof. Oh, look, BB's fast asleep. Oh, look, he's sucking his thumb, look. Oh. Sweet dreams, BB. What's the purpose of clamping ourselves to the bed? I think I might have missed that with everything else that's going on. Well, maybe it's not been explained yet. I don't know. Going very well, Tao. How you doing, bro? Nice to have you, Mello. Sam? You look too real. Can you see me? How are things over there? Still not under guard. Still not chained up. Still can't leave. But if you can keep making connections, if you can get to me, we can go back east, back home. Thank you. I mean that. It's bad. There are fewer and fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together, to help one another. And if we as a people can't do that, if we can't reconnect, then, well, it's like Bridget said, extinction. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't going to get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. Stop staring into my soul. She is freaky, man. I'll be waiting, Sam. That is uncanny valley to a whole new level. Waiting for you. Come and find me. Oh God, Jesus Christ, that made me fuck it. Jesus, fuck my life. I'm gonna have a poop. Sam, this is Hartman. Since you're awake, it might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? It's good for the body and soul, and also my research, as it happens. Uh, you go have a poop first. Uh, we'll have a poop. Poop before the shower. Best toilet ever. <laughs> Ride with Norman Reedus on AMC. <laughs> you gotta love it. Um, we'll take a shower. 
They're kind of sort of gathering some of our um, bodily waste, some fluids to uh, analyze, aren't they? Study other people with dooms? Everyone in bridges, myself and Mama. Results thus far are inconclusive. But you possess other singular qualities, being a repatriate as well. I must confess to a measure of optimism. Processing fluids, waste products, dry relic, dispensing. Whoa. That looks crazy, man. There. Take the sample with you. Should the opportunity arise, try using it on a BT. I'm Dude, curious what? to see how they react. Oh, that don't sound good. Who knows? It may even prove beneficial to you. There was an old research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on BTs. It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the Death Stranding, but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. There may well be hope for humanity. Sam, I have no interest in rebuilding America. I want to recover the past. Five, oh, four, it's almost three, time. Two, one. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? I said, then what? Sam, sorry to bother you while you're taking a oh, break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. Oh, maybe it'll help you rest easier. We received a number of messages addressed to you. And I've not taken a look myself, but I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks, as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. With the Cairo network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, we'll be able to recover more and more information, such as the previous expedition's logs and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting archives. Might make for interesting reading. Um, all right, let's just see if there's anything new to interact with. Let's, because we couldn't do the table last time, could we? Unleash the beast, monsterenergy.com. I'm going to have to go and buy myself a monster energy drink later on. Uh, so thirsty. Oh. <laughs> you're gonna be, you're gonna be jumping around, mate. You're gonna, you got no idea what you just did, bro. The amount of caffeine you just consumed. Uh, stamina increased by ten percent can be boosted. Oh, let's just get some more. Guys, get, get another can down, you mate. You'd be piddling all night long, but go on, wiggle your toes for me again. Go on, give me the toe wiggle. Come on, give me the toe wiggle. There we go. <laughs> So we've got a little bit of extra stamina. I like this. Not the good thing. All right. So we probably shouldn't drink all our monster. Uh... <laughs> that is fucking freaky, dude. Stop doing that, mate. Oh my god, it's so weird. It is such a strange game. Stop. Stop it. All right. Just stop it. Giving me the fucking eyeball and all that. Uh. All right, let's activate the terminal. I don't think there's anything I can actually do here apart from this, because... All right, let's, let's do my... 
Uh, Benjamin Hancock and George Batten. So let's have a look at what these are all about. Oh, and we got some likes. Sorry, Sam, bad news. So this is the distribution center guy, right? Benjamin Hancock. Thanks for delivering those rare metals, Sam. Everyone at the distro center really appreciates you coming through for us. I'm afraid I've got some bad news for you, though. That bike you saw outside, its battery's dead. Oh, sorted. Oh, hang on. I've got the hiccups. You'll have to give it you'll have to give it some juice if you want to use it. Only need to do it once though. Auto charger should kick in after. Okay. Sorry if we got your hopes up. It's all right, Matt. I was too worried about BB, to be honest. Don't, don't sweat it, bro. Um, I've also got some more bad news for you. You see, different facilities have to work together sharing materials so everyone gets what they need. And to make sure that everything that's produced gets put to proper use. And that's why guys like you are so important. Without the porters, the whole system falls apart. Possibly even the whole world. Or oh, one sec. That's right, girlfriend's just going out. Uh, anyway, there's this guy, George Baton, over at the way station. He used to be a reliable porter, but lately it's like pulling teeth getting him to make even the simplest delivery. He keeps moaning about being scared or not having enough oxy or whatever. Always some excuse. Even when he does agree to make a run, he's liable to lose half his load en route. <laughs> that sounds so wrong. So yeah, that's why we've finished your materials at the moment. I'm sure you'll soon help us put that to right. <laughs> it's even got... <laughs> Oh my lord. We counted on you, Sam. I swear to god, they had a piss take making this game, didn't they? Uh George Battle. More than Oxy. Uh Sam, the man our saviour. Things are looking up here at the way station. Everything feels better somehow. We were all bright-eyed and bushy-tailed when we set ourselves up, but three years of isolation and loneliness will change anyone's tune. Hell, when we first got here, I can smell the girlfriend's uh, perfume. That's gorgeous. Uh, when we first got here, we were putting up signs for porters and whatnot. But after a while, some... Oh, shut it! But after a while, some guys got too scared to even sit, set foot outside. When Central went up, I told myself this was it. America's done. Everyone was feeling it too, and the mood was just bleak. And then you waltzed on in. I know what you're thinking. At first, I thought it was just the oxytocin too. But that's not it. Not all of it, anyhow. You gave us the glimmer of hope we needed by bringing us into the chiral network. We're back in the game now. Been thinking of putting up signs again. Watchtowers too. Before long, we'll be opening up new delivery routes, mark my words. It's still scary out there though. All the oxygen in the world won't help us deal with mules, let alone BTs. We pooped ourselves every time we catch sight of one and end up dropping half our equipment. Honestly, a part of me is still a little worried that we won't be able to keep it up. And that's why we need you, Sam. You're not scared of anything, right? So go show us how it's done. Cool stuff. Um, data. So this is um, so this is the interviews. We didn't have these. Okay, let's have a look at this then. Let's start with Timefall. Seems to go past. So Timefall was first recorded when the Death Stranding occurred three years ago. And despite all the years that have passed since then, we are no closer to understanding how or why it accelerates the passage of time for the objects and organisms it touches, or why it immediately turns to ordinary water having done so. Some researchers have gone as far as to posit this process as stealing time. As for why timefall is observed only in certain places, all that we know for certain is that it is somehow affected by local chiral concentrations. This is merely a hunch, but something in me suspects that the Death Stranding may have warped our perception of the passage of time. Not that's necessarily a bad thing, you understand. We humans can conceive of our own deaths and even of the possibility of a place beyond death, yes. We have the capacity to conceptualise the future, an evolutionary advantage which aided our development as a species. Well, what if Timefall has given us a new supercharged version of this essential ability? One that will take us to the next stage of our evolution. Perhaps we wouldn't need to hole ourselves up in the Knot Cities. Perhaps, in time, the Death Stranding will come to be seen as the phenomenon that saved our species. Exciting thoughts, I'm sure you'll agree. I for one can't wait to set out on our journey. Who knows, 
what awaits us. Right, bridge babies. Look, I'm kind of new here at bridges, so I don't know if any of this will be useful to you. Still, I'm happy to talk about BB's bridge babies, if that's what you want. They call me Deadman, on account of my familiarity with the dead. Get it? We've always been on good terms, you see. We used to have regular little chats about when I worked in the mall. Anyway, that's also the reason I work on BB maintenance and research, to learn more about those who are no longer with us. But I digress. The fact is, Bridge Babies were already being issued to our forces in the field before I joined Bridges. What's more, research into the little guys had already been conducted long, long ago, but no one took the plunge and put what they discovered to practical use. Still, what that did mean is that when Bridges wanted to build our own BBs, most of the work has already been done for us. We just needed to follow the instruction manual, so to speak. Which isn't to say that we have any idea how they work. Not how they can detect BTs or how they connect this world to the other side. We still have much to learn about our little friends, but one thing is certain. Their continued study will lead us to a greater understanding of the stranding and of life and death itself. That much, I can assure you. Well, I think that's about all I have to tell you today. Hopefully, I'll have something new to share next time we chew the fat. See you around, I guess. Mules. So hang on, that's Die Hardman. That's Deadman. Who's Hartman? You can see the picture in the background. I don't, when, when did I meet Hartman? <laughs> uh, see, it, feel, it feels like so much has happened already. Uh, Bridges' primary objective is to rebuild America. And in order to rebuild, one of our main tasks is to reconnect cities and other settlements by re-establishing a delivery network. Back before the Death Stranding, the comms and delivery networks were what held society together. The whole thing was automated. AI managed deliveries carried out by drone. The belief was that taking people out of the equation would revolutionise... Oh gosh. Where am I? Would revolutionise the entire system. But things didn't quite pan out that way. Instead, we started seeing cases of what would eventually be dubbed Drone Syndrome. It was too much for some folks to accept, leaving everything to machines and nothing for the common man. And indeed, the oxytocin deficiency and hormonal imbalances we confirmed seemed to back up that assessment. Humanity needed to be part of the process. So laws were put in place, and we stepped back into the picture again. And then what happened? All the people put out of work by machines who got called up again convinced themselves society couldn't survive without them. And that brought on a whole new disorder. Delivery Dependent Syndrome, they called it. When the death syndrome tore us apart, the delivery problem spiralled even further. It wasn't helped by the fact that chiral clouds prevented planes and drones from flying, which meant we had to go back to relying completely on human couriers, whether we liked it or not. Eventually, delivering goods became all some lived for. They were obsessed, addicted, consumed by the desire to deliver. Over time, they turned into the mules we know and love today. Fuck me. Um, tips, I don't think we're going to worry too much about tips because we, we, we're kind of keeping pretty... Oh, yeah, I, I think we're okay on that front. Um, let's come out. Wow. Oh, see you later, lady over here. Take care, mate. Sam, we've received a distress call from the distro center staff. Check the order on the delivery terminal as soon as you're ready. Collect the delivery... Okay. Uh... Do what? What did he say? Oh, orders. There's no, there's no orders on there. What, what did he just ask me to do? I hope this game is saving, by the way. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Leave... I can, I can leave the private room. Should we just check on... Oh, examine the weapon rack. Well, there's no suits in there now, look.
Oh. Stop poking the baby. Knob. <laughs> it doesn't look like he enjoys that, Sam. Leave him alone. He's fast asleep, you knob. Change colour scheme. Uh, no, I quite like the blue, actually. Yeah, so basically, the, the way... Yeah, I mean... We, we have some innate power that means that... Stop doing that! It really freaks me the fuck out, dude. Seriously, you need to stop doing that, man. I don't like it. It feels like there's a connection between me and that dude on the screen. I don't like it, bro. That's very dodgy. It needs you need to stop that. <laughs> yeah, so we have something called dooms, which means we can detect to some degree tau something known as the beached things. Which are basic. I'm not entirely sure we know exactly what they are, but think of dead people, basically. So we can detect beach things. We're kind of hypersensitive to them, but all we know is that they're around when that when it happens. But through the link with the BB, uh, the beach baby, we can actually visualize them, if you like. Um, the thing is, people with dooms aren't really supposed to then also enhance it through the BB system. So we, we don't know what the outcome of that's going to be. Hopefully that, that's, that's kind of about as much as we... That's about as much as we know. Um, so, yeah, ho hopefully that helps explain that. Um, I don't know. I, I'm sure it said something about activating the terminal, but there's literally nothing I can do on the terminal, so... Dude. He's gonna jack himself in, looked out. So now we're we're sort of connected to uh what we agreed on in the Now we'll get a flashback. Are you alright? But you cannot release your son just yet. Believe me when I tell you this. Sister woman in the mask who's done nothing but lie to me. It's like a little memory that BB has. Hang on a minute, we don't actually. Oh. Sam, there's something I forgot to tell you. Uh -oh. It's about managing your BB stress levels and reducing the risk of autotoxemic attacks. There are a few things you can do if your BB starts showing signs of distress, such as. Such as take a moment to look after it. Cradle the pot, gently rock it, that sort of thing. Oh. Out of curiosity, how's it doing at the moment? Uh, before I answer that... Something wrong? When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too. With other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Mm, lead through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? No. You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks and placed in a pod. To be clear, this is before it's even born. The procedure halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. It is more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, all right? Dead man's honor. That is some messed up stuff, boy. So, should we see if we... Oh, hang on. BB can be soothed. LB and that. Oh, my God. LB. Down. 
Ah, we can. We want. Sam, check the delivery terminal. My beats are all out, I think. Yeah. You got any deliveries? While you're arresting, I ran some network diagnostics. Corellium monitoring and holographic systems are nominal. Unfortunately, our printer is offline. God damn it. I know, I know. After all the trouble you went through to bring us those materials. This one's on us. We ordered a part a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. Mules must have snatched it, caught God that order on route or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site, which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Uh, yeah. How do I take on mules? Orders available two. Recovery, chiral printer interface, and collect chiral crystals. So we will take that, and we will take that, but we'll listen to them first. Let's listen to the briefing on chiral crystals. Sam, the area around that distro center has produced a significant quantity of chiral crystals. Matter Roger. of fact, that's where the chirelium used in your Cupid's internal circuitry came from. They have a range of applications, including equipment fabrication. Bottom line? They're a valuable resource, and one you'll want to make the most of. I'll let Hartman explain in more detail, but... Cairo crystals don't exactly grow on trees. If you see any deposits, you should go out of your way to gather them. Especially since folks with dooms are the only ones that can. Provided they have the necessary equipment, that is. I'll see that it's added to your supplies for this order. Sam, it's Hartman. Following the discovery of the beach, we not only began to observe heretofore unseen phenomena, but a new type of matter, Chirelium. I say new, but it has doubtlessly existed since the dawn of the universe. We believe it was always there, like dark matter and certain particles, ever present, yet overlooked because we lacked the capacity to see it. Chirelium appears to be unbound by the constraints of physics as we understand them. It can stop time or move contrary to it. On occasion, it even defies gravity. In practical terms, it can stop or even reverse time and causes objects to float. A special cylindrical case is required to collect and store it. Suffice it to say, the procurement of samples is vital to our ongoing research. Bloody hell. Heads up, Sam. Distro Center staff's got a favor to ask. Probably best I start from the beginning. This one's on us. We ordered a part a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. Mules must have snatched it, caught that porter en route or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site, which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Hmm. It's an interesting question, though. It would be like saying it's seven days about nothing but shooting zombies, I, I guess. So, so no. It isn't really. It's actually got quite an intriguing uh, tail underneath the hood as well. Um, we'll we'll take it from there then. I've actually accepted those. Oh gosh, I don't think I've actually accepted them, have I? Do I? How do I accept? Uh, how? I'm not so. Hmm. Select multiple. Confirm. Ah, there we go. Is this right? Didn't look like it was uh, highlighted. Okay, so we've got both of those then, haven't we? Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. If you don't have it on you, consider fabricating one. Never know when you'll need to recon an area. 
Right, maybe we should make one of those then. Or has it... Oh no, has it given me one, has it? Uh, we will load all, <coughs> then auto-arrange. So... What, what? Oh god! Uh, I've got. I've only got one ladder, but I seem to have like three PCCs. That seems a bit excessive. Why do I need three PCCs? Did the game just give me all of those? I've got one ladder and one climbing anchor. That thing you're holding is a crystal collector. Now, as the name suggests. Wow. Provide secure storage for any crystals you gather. I wonder if those boots are knackered. I, I don't, maybe I don't need to be carrying those boots around. Is there a way to look at their Allow durability? Chiral crystals appear gold to the naked eye and are frequently found in formations resembling human handprints. The surrounding rocks and debris tend to float a few feet above the I know, ground. Advena. And they are most commonly found in areas with high precipitation. Got all that? Hmm. Hmm. Rain, floating rocks, golden handprints. That's your trifecta. Look for these three things and you'll find the crystals. If you've been especially observant, then perhaps you already know where to look. Is that is that hot? Order of time. So oh, how, how are we gonna <laughs> Why did the console duck cross the street to render the houses on the other side? Winking face. <laughs> Who the fuck was that? <laughs> Elegant, you're such a dick. <laughs> oh, I like that one. You're such a knob. What a big airy knob. Thank you for, thank you for the 44. Thank you for the tier 3 sub, dude. I bet you're waiting all month for that one, haven't you? <laughs> I can imagine him sitting there, his little ginger egg cackling to himself. God, that's that's got a proper rub grub up the wrong way, that one is. <laughs> thank, thank you for the 44 and thank you for the tier 3, Alagon. How are you, sir? How's the family doing, mate? Hmm. Oh, that's a good one. Such a turd. Right, now, we need to go and collect. So we've got to retrieve... Wow. So, I mean, what, what do I do? I mean, the mules are just going to kick my ass, right? I mean, have they, have they got weapons? I mean, I haven't got anything, have I? Cliff, ladders. It looks like there's a sort of reasonably well-traveled route. I also need to sort out that. Uh, wasn't there a bike around here somewhere? I have, I've got... I'll tell you what, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing now. This is the one we need to get the, the fuel for, isn't it? What what should we do then? Should we just head up? Should we just head up here? Um, that looks fairly fairly straightforward, doesn't it? Where's my first checkpoint? I don't know, I feel like maybe I should have manufactured something, perhaps. Oh wow, look at that. Oh wow, look at this. What a journey ahead. Holy wow. Yeah, I found loads of crystals, yeah. Yeah, there's been loads. I mean, I suppose what I could do is I could build one of those watchtowers and it would pretty much tell me where it is, wouldn't it? But we'll head up here and see what happens. Yeah, I don't know, Mr. Badhammer. I'm, I'm really not sure about the whole... Uh... Call it a rule or a habit, but most mules almost always bring stolen shipments home with them. Find the post box, steal back the cargo. Oh, right. That. Find the but post be careful. Box. These guys are armed. If this goes sideways, be ready to fight. Okay, and how do I do that? Attack uh, attack with X a mule repeatedly. 
Got some sort of punch attack by the looks of it. Oh wow, check him out, man. Uh, you posted an absolutely brilliant video about copyright law in the real world section. Well worth watching. All right, mate. Thank you. Equipping strands. Use to select and equip a strand. A strand can be used to quickly and silently render enemies unconscious. Do what, dude? A strand. Can be used to bind... Is it like a... Is it like a ranged... Is it like a lasso or something? Is that what that is? That's interesting. So if you sneak up on a mule from behind, you can use a strand to bind them. How am I going to sneak up behind someone wearing all this? <laughs> all right but maybe i should have brought all this gear <laughs> i think you should put some ladders away or something i certainly don't need all those pccs do i the, the chiral create you create things it is elegant yeah thank you ever so much bro yeah i some chiral crystals there look There we go. Uh, so we got five. Displayed at the bottom of the cuffs, cufflinks map. Your blood level, BB stress level, your stamina, footwear, durability, current weight carried, and your total number of likes are also displayed here. How do you do the cufflinks map? That's not this thing, is it? Oh, it is, yeah. So I've got five CG chiral crystals at present. Uh, destroyed. What, what does that mean by destroyed? Does that mean the case is destroyed? I still don't really understand how we get access to those things. Uh, I, I, I can I can crouch and go sneaky. There, there, there is a, a sneaky sneaky. Oh 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 oh! Careful, mate. Careful, Brett. Oh, there's a cave there. Before you approach the mule drop site, we recommend you use a watchtower to confirm the location of the post box. Containing our cargo. Well, that's a good idea. Oh, that is a good idea. Uh, shall we just get over that ridge and pop in a, pop in a watch that? Let's go and ch check out the cave. Oh, hang on. Uh, a well oh, I missed all that. RB cargo scanner. <laughs> oh, shit. There's a dude over there, look. <laughs> Ah, knackers, bro. So how do I do this then? So we do that. We do... That. And then I have to do this. Uh... Oh, that's a post box. How come I can't pull that down? Oh, steep slope. Uh, I don't like that knob over there one little bit. Steep slope detect. Oh, there we go. Not oh, that is so cool. Construction complete. Right, 
cavalieri This was a terrible place to build it. There it is. There it is. That's what I'm after. It looks like there's at least two mules, doesn't it? Should we should we try and take one down? Sneaky, sneaky. If we uh, give it a go, and check out the uh, the cave first. This is fucking crazy. Man. He's got some sort of like, I don't know, has he got like a spear or something in his hand? So, oh, Sam can hide in grass. Cool. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Just pick up everything, bro. <laughs> wonder if we could go sneaky sneaky to get this post box without... Oh, look at this. This is crazy, dude. Can I say a few words about the concept of this game? Oh, it's, it's, I'll tell you what, Elegon. It, it, it's constantly evolving. I mean, it's... The, the, the story alone is is just so meandering right now. Uh, but but it, it pulls you in. I mean, the, the whole concept of it is just absolutely just off the charts, dude. But, but it's fascinating. I, I mean, I really mean that, dude. You know, we, we quite often all sit here, don't we? You know, talking about, oh, we need something fresh and new. And yet, something like this comes along. And it's so alien in so many ways, mate. Um, the one thing I'm really struggling with right now, Elegon, is to try and describe how much fun it is to actually move this dude around. Is that, is that a dude there? Some... I don't know. Do you reckon we could just go in? If I get that out, put that, yeah. Yeah, it's something that that you just can't. Oh, that looks proper fast flowing, man. Is that? Am I going to end up? I think I'll go down there. Um, yeah, that. <sighs> I, I don't know, Ella. It's so hard to try and articulate. You, you're not just pressing a button to move the character. Everything about the way this guy moves is something that you just can't really translate in, in terms of try, trying to get across what, what he's like to move around. Just moving this dude around in this world is fun. Oh right! Oh, we can hold our breath as well, couldn't we? Yeah, I forgot about that. And we've got some, we've got some increased stamina as well, haven't we? Due to our uh... wait, is that's a dude? That is a dude. That is a dude. Look. So how 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 do I use this? How do I use this thing? How close do I have to get to him before I? Oh yes, like a boss, mate. Like a boss. And I've got some boots. Ooh. Holy shit! Look at all the loot! <laughs> oh god! We need the coral. We'll carry that on our back. Lost cargo, especially. How much of this shall I take with me? Oh my god, there's so much loot. Shall I take some of these? I don't really know how this works, though. We don't, we don't really get it, do we? Oh, it says I'm already heavy. I'm on 71.3 kilos. That's probably bad, right? We could always come back, couldn't we? I don't know where to get... Uh, I think we'll leave it. I think we'll just leave that. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. No, I need to confirm the interface, don't I? Oh, that looks top heavy, mate. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, uh, if we head back then, that, that's pretty much everything done, isn't it? Proper stealthy, not stealthy. Let's just, uh... Oh, 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 bad call, bad call. Okay, okay, okay. 
Ooh, yeah, I should have done smart off. I should have done Shania optimized cargo. Let me I'm just trying to get away from the camp, dude. I'll do it in the cave. So I, I was a bit, a bit uncertain about my uh, my general whereabouts there, bro. So yeah, so if I go back into here, go to cargo. Looks like you've got an empty container there, huh? Feel free to submit junk like that to Bridges. You might not have a use for it, but we do. An empty container, have I? Why is that? A destroyed one, or there we go. God, I gotta remember to confirm, haven't I? <clears throat> I wonder if you can just hold it down to do it and start to scroll down. Problems if you tip over. Um, I think you lose your. I, I, I suppose. You've got, I mean, you've got a health bar, so presumably if it's a bad fall, you'd lose health. You'd also drop your cargo, or damage your cargo. I don't know, I don't think I've got a light or anything. I'm not sure, I don't, I don't think I have, bro. Uh, I mean, I've got things like, ooh. I don't actually know. Oh, I picked, oh, I didn't, ah. Interesting. I've got, oh, what's this? Change footwear. How do you know what the current durability on those is? I don't. I can. Ha I can have a wee wee. Oh yes! Yeah, so look at that. Oh Jesus! That feels bad, mate. Oh blimey! Oh, holy balls! Um. How you doing, BB? <laughs> La -di -da 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 -di -di -da. Oh, let's give me a little love heart. That's so cute. How you doing, little fella? Gucci, 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 Gucci. <laughs> and I've got a pish room, as James called it, as well, look. Look at that. So if another player comes and pisses on that, appar apparently we can create things. I don't know what we create, but... Ah, <laughs> uh, well, apparently I was a bit... A bit gutted yesterday, actually, Flora. I, I, I'd been told by someone that sent me a message on Discord that the original dub was done with the Japanese voiceover, but apparently it isn't. Apparently the dub is actually... So the lip sync is in English, isn't it? So I kind of wanted to play it in Japanese, to be fair, mate. Have we, have we completed both missions? I think we have, haven't we? I think. Are you alright, Pickle P? How are you, mate? Uh, Mr. Bad Habits, thank you for the uh, the biddies, mate. Thank you very much for the biddies. Sorry. Thank you. Might as well grab some of them, right? Oh, BB is so gorgeous, mate. We've been told not to get attached to BB, though. Whoever left this rape here, it, it needs a serious, uh, some serious respect, don't they? Okay, we gave them some likes. Self infiltration, man. Mules. Damn addicts chasing a cargo high. Shame uh, I was going to suggest playing it in Japanese. From the Back in the day, AI did everything. Deliveries right. were handled by unmanned vehicles and drones. And all we had to do was sit back and let them work. It was revolutionary. Damn it, singularity. No reason for it not to take off. But it didn't. People didn't like it when we took the human element out of the service industry. So, after some consideration, we put it back in. 
made jobs no one really needed and gave them the folks who couldn't live without them. And from there, it snowballed. Now we got cults of cargo chasing crazies who get off on hijacking shipments. Jackal's always on the lookout for the next order. Make sure you're not him. Yeah, it's, it's, I mean, yeah, the, the plan was to play it with the Japanese original voices. But like I said, I was a bit, a bit good because I, I, I'd been told incorrectly that the original lip sync was done for the Japanese voiceover. So it would have been perfect. Eh? Uh, I'll probably still do it in Japanese. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until the parked weapons restrictions lifted. Got a little shout out. Hello. Name's Sam. Can't wait to get that boy. So I think I think we did all right there, didn't we? That was quite quite handy finding that little uh, secret way through. I, I like the um, the strand. That was cool tying up the dude. Scan. Scanning bridges ID. <laughs> Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until... Oh, that was a Black Mirror episode, so quite... Thank you. Yeah, with the woman that was trying to, um... Get millions of social media likes and hits, yeah. That's a good episode. Chiral crystal deliveries are a little different from the usual. The process is pretty simple, though. Access the delivery terminal to drop off any chiral crystals you're carrying. Right, so presumably... We can just hand both of these in then, right? So it's like, that's a du double handed, I think, as far as what I can do. You're right, Jax. Guys, ah, it's such a good feeling when you come back. Um, make delivery, so we have completed the chiral printer interface mission, haven't we? Um, confirm. What about the chiral crystal one? Ah, oh, it's been really good, Simi. Really good, dude. Order. Sorry to push you through so much trouble, but trust me, it'll be worth it. Excellent. The unit doesn't have a scratch on it. Never doubted you'd come through for us. So presumably that lets us make or use the fabrication terminals and things as well does it everything is awesome uh, bridges hq is providing design data for the following nice well i imagine Condition new boots what they are out there nothing ruins your day like shoes falling apart while you're on the job carry on like that and it's only a matter of time before you injure yourself i've arranged for boots to be added to your supplies bridges standard issue so they ought to fit you fine you should always carry an extra pair. But if you forget or run into trouble, you can fabricate another via a terminal at one of our many facilities. I think I've already got a pair, haven't I? New interview days are required. Necrosis and the ancient Egyptian view of life and death. That sounds interesting. Two years ago, distribution centre west of Cattle Knot City and the Chiral Network won. Okay, right. Uh... Good work, Sam. Seems your connection level is increasing. It is three stars. As your connection level increases, larger quantities of resources will be made available to you at our facilities. Okay. So, Richie's Guard Matches. Use his data to gain access to a level two or higher structure and select Customize Structure. Chiral crystals can now be used at all UCA affiliated facilities. The amount of materials that can be used at the distribution center west of Capital City 
has been... Some of this facility's bandwidth has been shared with Sam. Nice. More structures can now be built within the Coral Network area. Okay. Max amount ownable has been increased to 660. Oh, okay. All right. Makes sense. It's just constantly unlocking new things, isn't it? Just every single sort of encounter, there's something else happening. It's it's very well done, actually. For those of us that like all those uh, aggressive crafting games. An extraordinarily useful device that can only function because of the manner in which our network utilizes the beach, enabling us to transfer massive volumes of data instantaneously. Since under normal circumstances, such transfers would take hours, if not days, some have speculated that the chiral network might, in essence, be a time machine. That it is transmitting data into the past. Suffice it to say, we have yet to fully grasp the fundamental nature of the network and the beach which we have come to rely on. One might liken our relationship with it to that of primitive man's with fire. Is it useful? Quite. Is it dangerous? Undeniably so. Nevertheless, we have decided that the reward outweighs the risk. Furthermore, as the BTs are linked to the beach, it stands to reason that further study and experimentation could be of considerable benefit. The same could be said regarding you, of course. <laughs> Rest assured, I will keep you apprised of what I learn. You have my word. Okay, awesome. Thanks ever so much, Alagon. Seriously, bro. Thank you very, very much for the tier three, man. Thank you for the 44 as well, sir. I hope all is well. Um, so, chiral crystals can be recycled as a terminal by selecting delivery terminal recycle. Is that something we should be doing? Or am I supposed to be collecting them? I mean, it says I have 468. Got the five, oh, that's the five that I've got. So, put them in there, then, presumably, right? Is that right? Did I, did I do that right? Or have I? Oh, hang on. There we go. Excellent. It's starting to make a bit more sense now. Got some chiral crystals for us? These crystals only form in places with elevated chirillium levels. Which makes me wonder if expanding the network had something to do with it. Not a bad haul. Plenty enough for research. We'll take good care of it. I think I need to put some stuff in my stash. I, I can't have, I seem to have a lot of these PCCs, don't I? So that's that mission complete. I only got a B. Is that just because we didn't bring... Uh... Oh, container repair spray. Nice. Oh, and we can build bridges. Holy shit. Oh, wow. A new option has been added to... Yeah, okay. Excess chiral crystals can be deposited at any facility. They'll be added to the stores held on site. These local stores include materials that you can draw upon to fabricate equipment as needed. Okay. New title earned. People think of you as a portrait you can be relied upon for basic orders, but with time and effort, you may one day be recognized as a true legend. You have achieved delivery volume a grade 10. You can now carry more cargo. Nice! Oh, before I forget, this is for you. Ooh, gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, what's in the box, bro? That's container repair spray. repair spray for patching up cargo containers. Good for dealing with time fall degradation and all that. Useful stuff if you and your cargo have been through the ringer. 
We've added it to your supplies list, so it's readily available if and when you need it. Okay, all right. So it works in a similar way to the other stuff. Can only be used on cargo containers. Less effective when used in the midst of a time full shower, so try and find shelter first. Okay. Um, auto arrange cargo. Confirm. So what do I do with these destroyed metals then? I'm a bit confused by that. Um, it's obviously the whole thing's completely gone, so presumably that's recycle, is it? So can I click that and do anything with it? Or is this just load out? That's just load out, so... Let's go back to confirm on that front. There is a correlation between elevated corellium levels and increased crystal formation. This may well be the result of the network's expansion. You needn't worry though, local chiral density is still within an acceptable range. If you find any more, be sure to collect it. You'll be well rewarded. Okay. If you come into more chiral crystals, you can submit them at one of our facilities. And you can deposit other resources too, along with any items you don't need. Everything has its value. What we don't use as is, can be broken down into components for R&D and other applications. Excellent. So let's just go... Oh gosh, sorry, my bad. So if we go back into there and try the recycle option or the metals is it saying what you get for it so what do i do with hang on a minute <laughs> cargo to recycle but shall i just click confirm on that let's see the battered box that we've off So we got one metal out of that. Or is that... Yeah. In that case, right, so hang on then. Something I don't understand. If I go to share locker... Right? No, no, actually, sorry, not share locker. ...transported to its destination on your behalf. You can access the share locker to collect it. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Um, I want to go to the private locker. X grenade. A capsule containing Sam's condensed bodily excretions collected when he uses the shower. It breaks open when thrown, releasing its contents into the atmosphere. Has a noticeable effect on BTs, although the only way to find out what that effect might be is to try it. Use LT to aim and press RT to throw. The harder you press RT, the further the grenade will travel. Okay. So I suppose we could keep those on as they're fairly light, aren't they? What do I do with these metals, though? I actually don't understand this. What am I supposed to do with the metal? Do I do I just recycle that as well, or...? Because obviously I don't really need... I don't need two PCs, so I think I'd like to place that in the private locker. Um, I mean, these are actually not even on me are they so carry on back carry on back so that puts the pc back so i've got a ladder a pc and a climbing anchor on me um i'll keep another ladder on me the mule boots are they any better than those i mean i suppose i could transfer those to the private locker as well So that gives me a spare set plus the ones I've got. Alright, so, so that's two ladders. Yeah, alright, that, that makes sense. So let's also auto arrange and confirm. So the only thing I don't understand is what's this claim materials? Claim materials from the what's this? What does this mean? Does that mean I can just take some materials if I'm running low? Because what I don't get is... Let's go back to private locker. I have no idea what to do with that 100 metal there. 
put metal into your stash why i don't really get that place in private locker is, is that just like some metal banked is it is, is that just how it works so if my actual stocks get low i don't understand how i convert it to usable metal and that, that's the only question i've got Uh, cancel. We want to confirm that, don't we? See, I've got usable materials. 473 chiral, 960 resin, 1,471 metal. It is usable. It, it isn't, though, because when it's on me, it doesn't seem to change that usable metal quantity, uh, Smano. Thank you for your contribution. How do I get the bike up and running? Let's see if he's got any more missions. Oh, here we go. So we've got a bridge construction. We're going to do the bridge construction to start with because, oh, hang on. That seems to give me two different areas. Uh. Build a bridge at the designated construction site. I seem to have two where that actually is. Hey, Sam, mind doing me a favor? There's a bridge that needs building over a river just outside that distro center. It's too deep to ford, and we'd like a long-term solution. The foundation's already been laid, and everything required to finish the job should be in storage. All you need to do is carry the remaining materials to the construction area and use them to complete the bridge. If it turns out there isn't enough there for our needs after all, you'll have to come up with the rest on your own. I know you've got a lot on your plate right now, but remember, this bridge will make your life easier too. Where do you think that it's saying that that bridge needs to be constructed? Presumably that dot right there. I wonder what these are. Are these just a uh, mule presence, or are they? Looks like it, because it's constantly shifting about. So if we will take that, does it tell me what? Does that actually tell me what I need to? Crack We've added it. a bridge schematic to your PCC. The first step metal. is laying the foundation, after which you'll have to supply additional materials to finish the job. Plenty of rivers and canyons could do with a good bridge, you know. Take a stroll across one you built yourself, oh, and, and I guarantee y. you'll be glad you made the effort. Give it a try. Oh, that's cool, man. So I'm going to need, obviously, a PCC, which we've got. I've actually got two PCCs by the looks of it. Um... 800 metal and I've got 1,471 on me so I reckon we just head down there and give that a bash then yeah um metals 200 so that's a total of 400 metal I'm carrying I'm not sure I quite understand this. Jesus, mate. <laughs> You're right there, Sam. I might, I might have got a little bit overboard with the metal, bro. Jeez, dude. Begin the scan. Have a pleasant journey. Because I do have, if I go back down here, is there anywhere to look at my metals and things on that menu? I don't think there is, is there? Uh, I don't know, I'm not sure about that. You're right, Permary. How, how am I supposed to get, um, how do I see what, how much metal I've got? Area for the, bridge. the foundation should already be in place. With your help, We'll have the thing finished in no time. There should be a terminal nearby. Access it to submit additional materials. Alright, so it's... 
Is it down there? Where about is it? Down there. Oh, it's right outside the outpost. You're loading up some anointer. I don't know what that is, dude. Is that, uh, yeah, this on PC, uh, primary. <laughs> Six pack of coke. <laughs> Take it easy, Alligator. There should be a terminal nearby. Access it to submit additional materials. Okay. Uh, build the bridge of the designated construction site. Do I actually have to build it, or is this, is this hasn't somebody else already done this? I'm not entirely sure I get what's going on in here. Hmm. How do I submit materials? Ah, hang on. Bridge. Structure level. No, not not sure. I'm confused. I'm very confused. Um I did say there's supposed to be a terminal nearby, didn't it? No, not just... No, normally you just interact with that thing, don't you? An incomplete bridge foundation. Add materials to complete construction. Bridge length can be detected by foundation condition. Use that and select menu. I didn't see that option. When you see the... Uh, oh, you need to hold it down. Ah. Uh, Try holding it down until the delivery terminal responds. Ah, right, okay, that's my bad then. Although I am holding it down and it's doing fuck all, mate. Not gonna lie, so. Ah, there we go. Right, complete structure. Bridge completed provides power. So you can repair or dismantle. It requires, at the minute it's got, so if I do that, it'll give it 600. Uh, can you select multiple? You can. How do I confirm? How do I confirm? I don't get it. There's no confirm or anything. That just converts it back, doesn't it? Add materials. Click that. That will just let me carry it. So how do I... I just back out of it? Changes will be undone. Surely that's just going to cancel us out, right? Star guy. That's star guy. It can't be that complicated. So we come up to it. We have to hold down the structure menu. We complete the structure. We move that to the structure. We move that to the structure. But then what the fuck do I do? Oh, there's a confirm button there. I swear that wasn't there a minute ago. So presumably this was another player that put put the basic. Well, maybe I suppose it's a tutorial, isn't it? So probably. Oh, that looks freaking amazing. Everything is awesome. Level twenty-three. 
And that bridge will now stay there until time fully oh, roads it, presumably. That bridge should make life easier for a lot of people. You can be sure that every traveler and porter who passes that way will put it to good use. Keep an eye on for other spots that could do with another well-placed bridge. So would I normally use a PCC to create the bridge then? I wouldn't, right? In fact, that's it. In fact, we'll go back and just see. We, we can do it without actually doing it. Oh. See a load of these chiral crystals. Look, might as well grab them while we're here. So it's been really interesting, Jay. Sorry, really quite intriguing, actually, mate. It's uh, it's so different to anything else that I've ever played. Like, there's there's nothing else. I tell you, it's just it's gorgeous, dude. All those strands up there. All right, so let me just yeah, let me go over here a little ways. Hopefully, I won't pop this. So let's say I wanted to create my very own bridge here. I would presumably go into there. Oh, did I not bring any PCCs with me? What? That's not right. Change pages. Oh, well, there's pages of these things there. Oh, my God. So, I would use a PCC. I would then switch it to a bridge. And you can change the bridge length. Deep water detected. So, there you go. That, that's how I do the bridge then, look. And it would cost me... Is that saying... I, I take it... I mean, I won't do it, but that's really cool. That's really cool. That's really, really cool. I'm going to assume Benjamin Hancock is just simply a tutorial NPC, right? It says, adjust construction location. So, could you actually... Is that saying that you can actually just move it along if you feel like a player's kind of put it a little bit... Right. Deep water located. Uh. Okay. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> It as it prints. Right. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, uh, oh shit. Oh gosh, it wasn't me moving that one. It was me using my own bridge, wasn't it? I've just suddenly realised. I've just used my PCC, haven't I? It suddenly clicked what I've done. I, th I thought I could move this one. Oops. So I've actually just made my own. So hang on, can you dismantle things like this? So if I go structure menu, dismantle structure, presumably I can't because it's part of the tutorial. Wow. I wonder if you can do anything with... Um, I guess I could dismantle mine, right? Uh, yes, but but it won't give me the PCC back though, will it? So you know what? We'll leave it. We'll leave it. These look so freaking cool. I wonder what else we can build. Jesus, man. Uh, we still need to figure out how to get that motorbike up and running, don't we? So something about getting some sort of fuel cell in it. It's talking to me about bridge foundations now. Is that gonna uh, is that gonna disappear or it feels good? Oh someone just likes my sign. How'd you do signs? Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges.
We don't have to fence. <laughs> All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. All right, let's go get that other quest. So there's one more quest here, I think, isn't there? Sam, I've got a new order for you. Another delivery to make and a knot to link up. Check the terminal with uh, take on orders. Orders for Sam. So we've got the power supply unit delivery. So this is always the next main quest anyway, wasn't it? Because then we start heading further down to the other city hub. So let's have a listen. Now, you've done a fine job expanding the Cairo network. You're right, firm. But to make the most of it, we'll need to generate more power. We'll have to make a few hops before we can link up the closest city to... Once this wind farm is part of the Cairo network, we'll be able to route the energy it generates through the beach. Unlike traditional transmission methods, nothing is lost. We can provide power to distant regions and utilize facilities there as electrical substations. You're to deliver a key component. Should be finished printing. Take it to the wind farm and get us in business. Um, so we've got presumably BTs and the various normal hazards on the way over there. Well, well, that, that's not strictly speaking true at all, is it? Let, let's be honest, man. The, the online component's actually quite quite an intriguing one. I mean, I've just done that that previous quest, and I didn't have to use any of my own equipment because people already got ropes and ladders in place for it. So um, we don't want to fabricate anything. Did I actually pick up the quest? Did I actually pick it up? Why does it keep bringing me to fabricate equipment? Is that does it just do that every time you do one? Um, I think two ladders. I, th I, th I think two ladders climbing anchor in the PCC is always going to be enough. We just got to hope that somebody's already been over there on that online component, haven't we? And we've got the power supply unit, so we load that up. Auto arrange. I actually do that. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Right, let's do this. I wonder what the likes actually do. I, I like your level. You're affected by Rubik's Cube of Fate side. You're affected by Chesgate side. So these, because I think they boost your stamina back up as well, don't they? Right, where are we off to then? Let's have a ganders. So we're presumably heading up. Uh, all the way up there. We're going through some... I don't know, that looks quite heavy vegetation there, doesn't it? So we'll go over the bridge. And we'll head up this valley, I think. Someone's got a post box down there. Let's see how this works out. Weapons restrictions lifted. And if I remember to sort of have that equipped. So then we've got like the normal combat... Plus the strand stealth tape there. Yeah, th I mean the post box as well. You never know, people might leave stuff in the post box as well. It's not Looks like we're essentially, I mean the draw distance is glorious. I mean, I think we're heading straight up there, aren't we, by the looks of it? Yeah, mm -hmm. what's that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shows you the elevation as well, doesn't it? It's really, uh, really visual on everything. I'm not. I hope I haven't missed anything about the bike. I, I, I'm, I'm a bit concerned. I'm not. I won't panic just yet. <coughs> Oh gosh. Yeah, look, Benjamin Hancock mail, so. We'll get a little bit closer and then check out our incoming. <clears throat> a crypto buyout acquired. And what are they for exactly? I mean, I should really be using those once in a while, right? How do I actually eat it?
Why can't I eat it? Is it just because I don't need to, presumably, then, yeah? Yeah, the bite, I mean, because the, the whole start cutscene was with that bite, wouldn't it? I'd, I'd be mad if you can get that. I wonder how it works, though. I, I can't imagine it's, I, mean, I don't know, can you, like, 3D print them or something? Yeah, I think that's why I can't use it, because my, my health's maxed out, isn't it? Hey, then, BB. It's all right. Don't you worry, little fella. <laughs> it's just mad, isn't it? Oh, I can hear a storm coming in. Oh, that, that sucks, mate. That really does suck. The, the baby helps us detect, because this, this is called... What's this called? This, this is called Timefall now, Elagon. So this rain, essentially anything it touches, it essentially ages it. And during the time fall, there's a chance that we'll get the, uh, the beach things. And the baby enables me to uh, actually see them, basically. So although I have an inherent ability because I have dooms, so all that. What, what are the little footprints mean? So although I can... Oh. I'm sensitive to... Oh, pick up. What's this? There we go. Sandalweed acquired. Change for... Treasured by porters as an emergency replacement for boots. Sandalweed is not very durable, but can save you in a pinch. When walking, these footsteps can are almost inaudible to others. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, interesting. So we could, we could, oh, should we, uh, can, can I switch, can I switch them on the fly or is it a little bit? Has he got, has he got his sandals on? And then presumably I can just pop back my, oh, that's cool. Risky, risky. Yeah, ghost radar. I like it. <laughs> totally one of those, right? You picked up George Baton's cargo. A jetpack. Uh, because that would be really bad, wouldn't it? If time fall hit while you were like 100 meters in the air. Oh, and also that's explained by the. I, I call it the chiral. I can't remember what it's called, but that's why all the drones and planes wouldn't work because of the chiral. I can't remember the name of it. I'm not picking up that metal because I, I really don't understand that metal thing. Oh wow, is that, is that actually the wind? I think that the actual wind's affecting how I walk now. Jesus Christ, there's something else I've got to start taking into consideration as well. Oh, it bloody is, mate. The wind's proper blowing me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, oh, who's that? Performance enhancing beverages.
Make a delivery. Deliver lost cargo. Not sure about that. Uh, why is it saying don't end trust? I don't really get it. Oh, I see. I see. I think I'm starting to understand how the menus were now. What about those beverages sitting right next to it? I wonder if we could drop those in here and get a little, uh, a little boost as well. Water grade 20. 24 new title skilled handler holy shit dude and we get more is that more cargo capacity as well is that thing behind us is somewhere so, so who's that there is, is that actually someone there or is that just let's just see if he's got anything In the shared locker. Claim cargo. Uh, and we're off all the way down there, aren't we? Oh, strong wind will make movement trickier and will also deplete stamina more quickly. A headwind will slow movement while a tailwind will speed you along slightly. These effects can be reduced by arranging your cargo so that it offers less wind resistance. Jesus Christ, dude. I wonder what that is up there. I can really feel that wind. It's so weird the way it feels on the controller. Is that another post box? So in theory, I could pick up that lost card and just drop it in there just for some free lines then, right? Um, uh, make delivery. Deliver lost cargo. So you put that into... It's already in there. That's why I got confused. It's a really, really nice heads-up display and user interface once you get your head around it. it. It's just, it's so busy and there's so much information. It, 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 it just takes you a while to get into the swing of things. How do you set the hologram up there? Is, is that something we unlock later on? To actually have a post box with a hologram, is it? Or... I'm going to have a look what that structure is up there. What's that? Well, what was that then? So I suppose if I was to go into here and drink a monster drink... That did not increase my stamina. That wind's cr no, I the audio is just freaking amazing. There might not be anything. So we are heading straight through here by the looks of it, aren't we? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Steady on. 
Steady on, fella. Steady on. Field bloody heavy Javoshua. It's real. I don't understand how they've done it. There's, there's something really, really bizarre about the way they've made the character feel. I, I, I can't even begin to imagine the mathematics behind all of this because it's like every, every gust of wind, every freaking misstep. If I take that, I'm going to be in a lot of trouble, aren't I? I was kind of hoping we'd find a rope or something. You just know there's going to be um, BTs down here, don't you? Ah, oh, fuck you, dude. Go. Shit. I should have known Ben's come straight through the bloody forest, shouldn't I? Get your ass down, mate. Two hundred metal. That's a lot of metal, bro. I don't know to put my flip flops on, mate. So I put my flip flops on, or. Oh, God, they're everywhere, man. Ah! I actually don't like pressing that button because I'm actually i actually better off not knowing they're there. to get through here. Sexy boots on, really. Where's me sexy boots? That's not me sexy boots, is it? Where's me? Oh god, I've got. Oh no, I've lost me sexy boots. Oh, they want some use only. Shit. Oh, there's more in front of me. Tuds. Oh, dude, there's one right behind the tree as well.
Oh, that thing's going batshit crazy, dude. I, I did think about throwing that thing, but I can't remember where it is, bro. <laughs> where, where is it? You mean that thing? No? The X grenade. That one. Don't, I don't seem to have any of it with me, according to this. Or is it that? Lives on. <gasps> Didn't seem to really do anything. It hit it. <laughs> it sort of bounced off it, but. I don't want to go and lob another one. Is that a bit hard to turn in it? I think I'm making a terrible mistake. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, this is such a bad idea. I have no idea what that did. I, I've just stopped responding to walking simulator comments permanently. <laughs> So these, but this is, but these are presumably, but so they, ah, that's what they were then. They, these are like the modern equivalent of the wind uh, turbines, aren't they? It didn't. It, that's the point. That's man. It didn't. That's exactly what I thought. I was thinking it would like, you, you know, they wouldn't like it and that they'd sort of move away from the area. They'd see it as hazardous. But they actually didn't do that at all, dude. They didn't move a fucking inch, mate. Maybe, maybe we still need more research. Maybe by throwing them, we will be bringing some information back, if that makes sense. Do you know what I mean? Quite interested by that, because we can get... I'm going to assume we can get new stuff every time we take a shower, right? Yeah, but very good so far, sir. Yeah, very, very much... Uh, very, very different. Deliver requested cargo. Uh, complete order. Excellent. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm not used to uh, the menu defaulting to what I want it to do. I think the pennies just dropped on that. Delivering cargo. You are iceberg. Nah, they didn't move. They didn't move an inch. This unit, we should be able to power the distro center via the chiral network. Other places too, if it works. Here's hoping the UCA can put our electricity to good use. Mind if I have a look? Incredible. How'd you get this here? You fly? I went all sneaky, but sneaky, Brian. That's what I did. Everything is awesome. Didn't call one of those. 
So that's the connection level for this particular outpost then, isn't it? So each outpost has its own connection level, presumably. All we need now is a connection to the chiral network. Go for it. I've got you covered on that front, matey. Yeah, that's been explained, Lizard. It's, uh... I can't remember. There's basically a, a substance. Well, I'll just call it chiral energy, because I can't remember exactly what it's called. Network bandwidth is a limited resource, and every structure you build consumes it. However, as you increase your connection level, the bandwidth available to you will increase as well. Nice. Right, we need to ca catch up on these interview data, don't we? You can now use the PCC to build generators. Now, why would we need generators, do you think? What else we can craft that's going to need power supply requests bridge links take on words make delivery and trust cargo in the garage the garage feature can be used as not at not cities and distribution centers interest holy shit look at that <laughs> we just go through a lot of bts coming through that forest mate jesus about time we did our part Thanks again. You know, I heard the rest of your team was wiped out. Makes what you're doing all the more incredible. You're a one-man expedition. I hope Amelie's doing as well as you. Wonder if she made it to Edgenaut City yet. It was her that put us in charge of the wind farm. I was with the group bringing up the rear while Amelie led the way. I never met her in person. But it was an honor to travel with her all the same. When you see her, feel free to tell her I said so, huh? Sam. Got a moment? I ran an experiment with your blood. It seems you were onto something. After dispersing an aerosolized sample of your blood in BT territory, Here we, we observed reduced activity. While this is hardly definitive, as we have no other repatriates to whom we can turn for additional testing, it does suggest that the bodily fluids of repatriates are repellent to BTs. Mama had the idea of developing a weapon to test this theory. Oh, I see. The prototype should be ready soon. And when it is, we'd like you to test it. There we go. I didn't think it was doing Sam, a lot. Sam, this is the perfect opportunity. We've almost got the whole region on the Chiral Network. All that's left is Port Knot City. Excellent. Return to Capital Knot City so you can pick up relief supplies for Port Knot. By the time you arrive, we can give you the completed prototype in person. One other thing. It's not very often porters get out to that wind farm. While you're there, you should pick up any outstanding orders. No sense coming all the way back here empty-handed if there's work to be done. Have a look at that delivery terminal. Okay, we'll do. Good work. New order available. Um, Please can access I... delivery terminal for further information. Can I go to my private locker from here? Oh no, sorry, my oh gosh, I did the wrong thing, didn't I? Uh Oh, sorry, no, no, I can't no, I can't go to my private quarters I was thinking of. That that doesn't that doesn't happen here, does it? Hey, great work. That wind farm you Ah oh, look, charging vehicles. By way of reward, I've added a little something to your PCC. Excellent a option. Generators recharge the batteries of all nearby devices. That includes machines, bikes, and other battery-powered vehicles. So does that mean we can charge up the bike back at the main area? I think it does, doesn't it? I think I think we can get the bike if we head back and put down a power generator near it or, or a wind generator, right? What do you think? Congrats, Sam. You're cleared to take on open orders. 
While they're not as high priority as the ones specifically assigned to you. Uh, I want to see. If you're already heading a certain way and you have room to spare, it couldn't hurt to do a little more, right? Just because they're not mission critical doesn't mean they're not important to someone. So why not do a good deed or two? So these are kind of like the side quests, are they? Um, so let's see what orders. So we've got urgent. Resin's delivery. That's going back. I think that's where the bike is as well, isn't it? So should we head back down there and try the generator? That seems like a no-brainer to me. We just got to get through those freaking BTs again. Oh, delivery time limit. 45 minutes. Oh, BB's not happy, look. BB's like, oh, oh shit. This is a somewhat unusual order. You're going to want to review the key points in the summary. And how exactly do I do that, my old mucker? Bridges has printing materials stored at the wind farm. We'd like you to bring some to the distro center. These materials are pretty varied, and to get the most out of the Cairo printer, we need as many different types as we can get. Hurry back. 32 kilos is a lot for a single, uh... So if we... Set that order. Did we just have a quick look at what the other orders were? That looks freaking heavy, bro. Delivery parameters updated. Time limit set. Oh, I think I think my stuff's getting damaged because I've had it for so long. Standard orders. Uh, we could take another one. I mean, I'm on 54 kilos, aren't I? Shall I risk it or not? Sam, double check the order summary. Oh. Uh, so completing delivery of materials to a given facility will increase the amount available at that facility of the construction of weapons and equipment for other functions. There is a limit to the amount of materials that a given facility can store. Yeah, we kind of kind of all making sense actually. So we are going there. That's another 15 kilos. Um, bloody hell. So if I take that quest. Did I just pick up metal from somewhere else? Oh, I think it's, I think this is going to go proper Pete Tong if I'm not careful eh? Seven, just 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 below the seventy kilo. Oh, hang on. Sorry. My bad. Oh, 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 oh. I wonder if there's another route we could take to get around the BTs. Yeah, I, I need to give him a rock, don't I? I was just thinking that. So if I go... How do I do that? If I check on BB... Oh. What was that red thing? Create a sign on Give him a little, uh, give him a little lullaby. Okay. Is he getting any better? <laughs> Is it doing anything? Is he getting happier or not? You alright, Shadow Storm? Oh, is that with uh, Warframe, is it? Uh, congratulations as well, Mario. I, I, I saw in chat you got you got a super duper new uh, legendary. Have you? It's going up very slowly, isn't it? Blowing these little uh, love bubbles, look. There we go. How you doing, little one? Okay, right, this is it. This is the big one then. Because th this could give us the. Uh... Is that the way out? Or... Oh, wow, he feels proper bonkers, man. 
Oh, Jesus. That does not feel good. Oh, someone's built a bridge. Right, where are... Oh, wow. Okay. I don't know why there's a freaking giant bridge there, but... I don't know if it's like, like come right down. Oh, I don't know. This, this is going to be bad. I have a bad feeling about this guy. Destiny 2. Yeah, I've been, I've been playing a little bit of Destiny 2 on the side, mate. Someone's built bridges. Look, there's loads of bridges down here. Someone's had weapons restrictions lifted. So, if we... That's a lot of likes he's got there, hasn't he? That's a really nice mushroom puddle. Look at all those little dudes. Yeah, I think I think I prefer Destiny 2 over Warframe, but I've, I've only really played like a pro probably at the most an hour to an hour and a half of each, really. So I, I, I take my, what you know my personal opinion with a pinch of salt, but there's some I just like Destiny. These bridges are freaking awesome. Oh, what the hell? Holy crap, there's like freaky BT handprints all over those rocks. What the fudge? <laughs> you don't need to worry about that anymore, though, Shadow Storm. I, I keep hearing people talking about Destiny and how they didn't like it. you got to bear in mind it's a completely different game now. Because they're, they're not under uh, uh, Activision Blizzard, are they? So, all, all, all that... All that talk about penny pinching and all that. It's a thing of the past now, mate. Hmm. No, you can't hate a game that's now moved on, can you? You know, you, you might go back to it and really enjoy it. Sounds like they've got some pretty cool ideas coming up with it. What, what's this? The vaulting system, I think it's called, isn't it? I mean, for the likes of me that's never played the game, it's fantastic. I can pick it up on Steam completely free. There we go. go and play it, decide if I like it, and then consider dropping some money on it, you know? I, I pay once for that, that content, I guess, and then, you know, like anything else, no different to a season pass for Borderlands, is it, really? Seems a pretty good system to me. So far, so good. No more than a full game, though, Miss Group. That's what I'm saying. You know, I, I can play the game for nothing. If I choose to play the latest content, what's it going to cost me? Presumably the cost of a, of a new game, right? So how, how... I can't really argue that, can I? And then for that, whatever it's going to cost me, let's say £50, I have to say, I was absolutely mind-blown with how much there was to do in Destiny 2. Like, I should imagine I would get many, 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 many hours of enjoyment out of it. Certainly not going to be penny pinching for my 40 or 50 quid. I don't know. How, how much is it? How much is the latest uh, expansion, if you like? I, did, I didn't look into it, to be honest. 
Do it, Bradley. Oh, look. This is so cool having this multiplayer element to the game. It really is. It's like every, every time you come back, it's something new. I can't wait to have a look at this generator and see if the bike works. Oh, careful, 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 Jesus. He's really struggling getting up here, I'll tell you. <laughs> so, so it's having a right proper go with the ladders, isn't it? Uh, okay, we're all right, we're all right. Is this even where we're supposed to be? Yeah. It is. Must be a little careful. I think, I think what I need to remember is that if you come out, you might as well use your ladders because they're just getting eroded, aren't they? I, I keep forgetting that. It, it's kind of like your equipment is persistent, isn't it? So, I mean... How would I do that? If I go to the map, look at my cargo. So, for example, is it? What have I actually got on there? Yeah, my ladder there, look. It's actually damaged. And my metals are getting damaged. But I, I, I can recycle those when we get in there. That ladder's not too bad. Is the one down on my hip. I suppose what you could do is you could actually drop one, couldn't you? So if you see a ladder in the world, presumably I could drop it and pick up another one. But it obviously is probably going to take some time for damage if it's been out in the world for long. But I need to, I need to start using things that I've brought out. And there's a PCC there, look. Yeah, it does. It, it fixes you. I can re I can repair the... I, I'm going to keep that. I've only got one of those, I think, at the minute. I think I can make more. But I'm going to use that for the primary cargoes rather than my ladders and things, if that makes sense. Ooh, just music kicking in again. What's the graph? Uh, I'm on a 1080 Ti uh, in a minute, Bradley. People have been dropping PCCs left, right and centre, haven't they? I think the only... It's, it's quite interesting, actually, because a game that, that's clearly got so much going on, normally I come away from the stream at the end of it and I'm just like, I just, you know, after stuff, I'm just, just not understood. I think the only thing that is, is throwing me for a bit of a warbler is, is the metals and things. I don't can't quite get my head around what, what's really going on with that. I don't see why some metal is classed as just being usable, whereas other metals are classed as being in cargo on my back. There's my bloody half-built bridge look. <laughs> I really should get rid of that. It's a bit of a blot on the landscape, isn't it? A lot of changes in Destiny. Is it the 22nd of September, isn't it? I think is, the, is, is that the big, the big D day. What even is that? What is that? Is that like a oh, oh shit! I forgot I was on the clock. What are the raids like? 
Are they quite challenging? I've heard that some of them have been. I don't know whether that's still the case. But does, it, does it require quite a lot of coordination? Have you done all those, uh, Miss Grip, all the raids and stuff like that? Oh, you've never done a raid? Oh, right. Yeah, I, I think that would be quite good fun trying to get to the point where you could uh, play about with it. I think I'm going to dismantle my bridge. Doing very well, Sam. Doing very well indeed, sir. Let's get rid of this hideous thing. Structure dismantle. Please stand clear of the designated construction area. How many is it, uh, Miss Group? How, how many for a raid? Is it like four, five, six? I've, I've got no idea. M most stuff in those sorts of games normally four-player co-op, aren't they? I don't know if uh, it's Destiny like groups of four, like three groups of four or something. I, I don't really know how it all works. What are these that I keep finding on the floor? They're like little, uh, little pebbles, like little cans or something. Six people, is it, for a ride? I, and I take it you definitely need all six. Like, if you try and go in with four or five, it's going to end very badly for you, is it? Beginning scan. Scanning bridges, ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until the punch. Cargo verified. Thank you. What happened to my smiley face? I swear I had a smiley face on there. Sam Porter Bridges. Yeah, I, I wouldn't do that. Uh, it's like doing uh, heists in GTA and pumps. Forget that, mate. I like content where you're sort of forced to get a little team together. I enjoy that. Right, okay. Make delivery. Deliver requested cargo. Complete order. So that was the urgent resins and the power supply inspection tool. So... I just realized you can just hold the A button down. You don't have to scroll down to it if you hold it. That's brilliant. Yeah, I think Destiny, you had to go to uh, outside sources then. this from the wind farm? <laughs> I can't imagine what a chore that must have been. Thank you. Huh? Made record time. Wow. Don't do things by halves, do you? Hard to believe one man could bring in a hole this big. Then again, you are a legend. Is that Death Stranding or shall we say Uber Eats? I don't know. Is there, is there a pun in there? Did we get an awesome? Well, everything is awesome! Bridges have provided the following sound data. Anything you need. This sound data can be listened to in your private room. To use it for a structure, gain access to a level 2 or higher structure and select Customize. Okay. Yeah, I still don't... That's the one thing I don't quite understand there, but... Yeah, I seem to remember back in Destiny 1, we all had to join a website or something. Didn't, didn't someone make some sort of, like, companion app so you could get into pickup groups for things? Can't quite remember. I don't know if Destiny 2 has always been the same, but... Everything is awesome! I had so many achievements today. Uh, Distribution Center Western Capital not has provided the following new hologram data. Benjamin Hancock. Chiral contamination 2. BTs are reaching out to us. Some of this facility's bandwidth has been shared with Sam. More structures can now be built. Okay, I like that system actually. Uh, wow, that's that's quite the increase. 
Wow, that's a huge increase. Is that normal? A bonus for delivery time. Look at that. <laughs> it's really hypnotic, actually. I really like that. <laughs> okay. Total weight of cargo delivered so far, 305 kilos. And we've travelled 16 kilometres so far. I don't know anyone who's done more to bring people together and get them back on their feet. It's hard to believe you're just one guy. Can't help wondering if the Great Deliverer isn't actually a small army. Because it sure seems like whenever someone's in trouble, you're there to lend a hand. It's enough to make you uh, think you just might make it all the way to the coast. Good luck out there. Like the hologram outside the post box earlier, Kibiji. Good work. Got you. New order available. Please access delivery terminal. So, take on orders. Let's have orders for Sam. So, we've got uh, recover confidential documents. That's going to be going back into that mule zone, possibly, isn't it? Quite fancy having another guy at one of those. For this retrieval order, you will be hunting down a book. An old school printed on paper book. A uh, what? Predates the Death Stranding. Paper? Even before the world went to shit, most were published in digital formats only. It's rare to find one intact these days. Apparently, this particular book was the work of researchers who may have anticipated the Death Stranding. It was en route to Hartman when it was taken. Mules, according to Waystation staff, in case you hadn't guessed. The book's no different from any other cargo to them. But to us, it's priceless. Get it back, ASAP. Quite fancy doing that. Could be like a nice little stealth one again, couldn't it? I'll leave what we've got. So, I mean, we've got tons of metals and resins and things now, haven't we? Uh, auto arrange, I think. I seem to have three PCCs on me. Do, do these all get... Does everything get repaired when you get back in? I think it does, you know. Oh, no, sorry. No, no, sorry. No, that's private locker. No, of course it doesn't. That, that, we've just been discussing that, haven't we? Uh, what do we do with those metals, then? So, presumably the metals I'm supposed to scrap, right? The grenades, we've obviously used all those. Uh, so, if I come out of that... Sorry, if I confirm that... Let me just head back in and just get rid of those metals. So, I think I recycle, don't I? By handing over excess materials to a facility, you can increase the amount stored on site. Now, these materials can then be used later for equipment fabrication and so forth. Just remember that each facility has separate stores and that the amount on hand differs from site to site. Don't get carried away. Don't get carried away. So, metals recycle. Yeah, it's flown by today, Mr. I was just thinking the same thing, mate. Yeah, I mean, you might as well give Warframe a go. I mean, I think a lot of people that have played Destiny have played Warframe, and it's free as well, isn't it? Or at least to a certain point. So that did give me the metal bat. I think I, have, I think the pennies just dropped there. Um, I think we will... Is there any other orders? Standard orders. Uh, I mean, we're not... I suppose, I suppose we could go and try and do that quest. Oh, that's 60 kilos. There's no freaking way, mate. Um, I mean, I could take that one. Because what we could do, we could go and get the loot, couldn't we? And then head down to that one. So I think I'll take that. Oh, I feel much more comfortable with the menus at the moment. Um...
Oh, I, I forgot to confirm. Sorry. I came back out one, didn't I? So, load all and auto arrange. Confirm. There we go. Thank you for your contribution. Yeah, I mean, I, I, all I can say about my... I, I, obviously, like I said, I'm not here to add any real weight to the discussion because I've only played Destiny 2 probably pro probably for about an hour and a half. And I've probably played Warframe maybe for about the same in total. Maybe maybe only for an hour. So uh, that's nothing. But the only thing... I just found Warframe a little bit too... Hey, Sam. You could probably get that bike running again if you charge it to the generator. Why not give it a try? Oh my god. I thought this was all the way back over there. I forgot this was here. Weapons yeah, I just found Destiny a little bit. I don't know. Uh, sorry, Warframe. Um, manic. Uh, it, it felt like it felt like just flying, spinning, dashing everywhere. It was just like, fuck me, dude. Uh, so I want to make... I need to use my PCC, don't I? Uh, where's my PCC's gone? Hang on a minute. What's going on here? Why do I not have any PCC's? I swear. I, oh, that, is that a PCC? That's climbing anchor. With spare spray. Ladders. I'm confused. Did I not have any PCC's? I swear I did. I didn't. <laughs> uh, I've only got two ladders. Oh, right. Okay. Well, that's my bad then. So I need to presumably go back inside the right to the terminal to get a PCC. Is that right? Beginning scan. Scanning bridges. ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Weapons detected. All weapons. I think I. Oh, I tell you what. I bet I've got a PCC stuck in. I swear I had a PCC. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Yeah, and, and that, that's it for me, Missy. I, if I wasn't streaming it, I think Warframe would be fine. It's just that there's no way I could try and read a chat and, and play Warframe effectively, I don't think. But probably the same with Destiny to some degree, but... Uh, take on orders... No, I want to... What do I want to do? Private locker. BCC. Uh, carry on back. Confirm. Then it's pretty much done, I think, right? Begin the scan. Have a pleasant trip. Yeah, I, th I honestly thought I'd got another one on me uh, for some reason. Why well, does resting do? That will uh, help the stamina bar, uh, I guess, uh, a little. There's another bridge over there. Huh? Right, Weapons so let's go and build a windmill over here. So we want to go into the PCC selection. Uh, so you've got two pages. We want to build a generator. And we want to presumably build it quite close to the bike, do we? Okay. How much did that cost me? I forgot to check. Right, and we'll recharge the batteries of any nearby rechargeable devices. Okay, so use the structure menu. So we know we need to hold that down now, don't we? Uh, so generates electricity, charges batteries, charging speed, boosted charge range, boosted custom. So that's for tier two, is it? So you can upgrade the structures at a later date. Okay, so is that actually charging the bike? It looks like it has been. <gasps> Use vehicle. You're shitting me. Ah! <laughs> uh, okay, accelerate, front reverse, boost, wheel spin while stationary. Oh, 
All right, make it stop. Jesus Christ. All right, that was, that was a little bit terrifying. Oh, my Lord. Oh, God, make it stop. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, back to that again. All right, this thing's... This thing's... How do I get off it? Okay. Oh, my God, that feels freaking sweet, dude. Nice. We got a bloody bike, bro. Oh, and, oh, hang on. And that's also got... Hang on. Sorry, my bad, my bad. Uh, that's also got a cargo menu, has it? Reverse trike. Looks like you can put something on it. Interesting. Let's do it. Let's do this. Holy fuck balls! <laughs> slow down, slow down, bro. <laughs> I know, it feels crazy, bro. All right, controls really start. Oh, it's amazing. What was what were the other buttons? What other buttons did it have? Oh, slow down, slow down. Jesus, good God. Oh, that feels freaking bonkers, mate. Holy wow. Uh right, let's get off. I'm stretching my legs. So if we if we carried a spare PCC on the bike, we could always we could always recharge it, couldn't we, I guess? Yeah. Way station west of Capital Not C. Way station west of Capital Not C. We're actually heading that way. So I'll carry yeah. that. Now, where are we going? We're actually supposed to be trying to get something up there, aren't we? So that is right up. What is it there? Right, we've got to get to that mule camp, haven't we? <laughs> it's terrifying, Yad. It's just so nice being able to, like, travel at speed, but it's also... Oh, oh, okay. Feels so good. The really nice thing is, it, it, it's like you can do anything at any time you want. It's not like you, you know, I can access all my different subsystems. It's really nice. Don't know how, uh, how close I want to get to. Uh, let's see. Oh, Jesus. I don't want to get too close because I think we went, didn't we go in through the cave? Be careful, 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 careful. Yeah, I think, I think, uh, I think this is, this is a bad route to be taking, to be honest. Uh, let's see if I can get up and over. Oh, yeah, there's the camp. Right, oh, we've got to be careful there. If I put a watchtower down, we'd be able to see them, wouldn't we? So what do I want? I want that, don't I? <laughs> this baby, you know what I was thinking actually? It's quite funny you mentioned Snowrunner, because this is basically Snowrunner, but with your own boots instead of giant ass trucks, basically. Can't see anybody down there. And that's making me very, very nervous. It's like it's abandoned, isn't it? What am I actually coming here for? When you've detected a piece of cargo, send out a cargo scanner ping with RB. You can check its location by looking at the map on your cufflinks. Well, I know that. So I'm actually supposed to be trying to find confidential documents. Got a bad feeling about it. Too quiet. Uh, 
I did ninja hog tie someone last time, didn't I? Oh shit, oh shit, there's millions of- Oh fucking hell, there's millions of them, mate! Oh, what the hell was that? Well, I think I've made a terrible mistake, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my lord, that doesn't look good, does it? Knickers, mate. Well, they're still coming after me. That was a terrible mistake. <laughs> I, I, di I didn't forget the bike. I just, <laughs> I just saw a lot of dudes lobbing spears at me by the looks of it. Okay. Well, that did not go quite according to plan. Not going to lie. Just there, look. It's literally just there. So close. If I could come through in on that side and just sneak up and grab it, what do you think? Contain the damage, lost cargo tranquilizer. I don't worry about that. Unlock the post box. I need to get the confidential documents. Carry on back. And I'm just gonna I'm gonna get out of that. Oh, 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 fuck, fuck, dicks, bollocks, fuck, dick, bollocks, fuck, dick, bollocks, bollocks, dicks, fuck. Okay. Get out of there, Sam. Oh, Jesus balls. Get over there. Come on. Oh, that don't sound good. Oh, shit, that's not good. Jesus Christ, that was fucking close. Stop loving things at me, you novice! Oh shit, it's right on top of me, mate! Oh! Fuck you, dude! Fuck you, dude! Fuck you, bro! <laughs> oh my god! There's millions of them, mate! There's millions of them! I'm gonna out of here! Oh god, I don't know what to do! Oh no! So I make it. Shall I make a jump for it? Oh, I don't know what to do. Whoa! Jump! Bro. Oh shit! Oh god, what happened then? You don't have the number. Oh, what? You do not. What? Did I? What? What did it just say about confidential documents? What did it just say? Did it just destroy the documents? Fuck my life. 
Enemy induced adrenaline rushes. Enemy encounters induced a rush of adrenaline. Oh, is that why the bar went? What's it? Uh, how do I check? Oh my god. Uh, do I have. Oh no, did I lose the book? Oh, did I lose the book? Yeah, but how? <laughs> what, so I just magic the bike up on the other side of the camp? <laughs> Did you not see where the bike was in relation to the camp? Uh, did I lose the... Uh, I wonder if I dropped it. Did, 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 oh, I dropped it when they twanged me, I think, look. Was it that? Disc-based media? No, it wasn't, was it? Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure what happened there, then. Yeah. Maybe that's it there. Maybe that's what that big... Oh, I can see the knob. Do, do you see the old uh, Kung Fu whammy I did on him? Oh, shit. There's a dude up on the on the cliff as well. I've got to get all the way back around to try and get the bike down on the lower area. I think we did quite well there, actually. It was, yeah. He, he must have got knocked out of my backpack. Look. Excellent. Excellent day, my little friends. Now, shall we carry on and drop it off? Or. Because we only need to get over there. I think that's where we're handing it in, isn't it? So I, I think we just do that. Where is it? Why is it not bringing. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I think, I think we just carry on around. Get it, and then we can come back a little a little lighter on our feet <laughs> to get the bike, right? Yeah, I've got a thank side. Yeah, Keep yeah. I, I tell you what, I've really enjoyed this today. Breath of fresh air. That the combat looks like it might be quite good. It's just that I was obviously very much outnumbered, wasn't I? But um, yeah, that that I was quite surprised how effective that. He really, he really went for it, didn't he? They gave him a right old smack in the chops. <gasps> oh, shit! Di oh, dude, what happened then, bro? Now, where's that going? Capital Not City. Which one's Capital Not City? Capital Not City is all the way over there, isn't it? I've no way I'm taking that all the way back. That's quite a cool mechanic, actually, having those uh, spears being lobbed at you. Wonder how the bike handles water. Wonder what happens. I'm going to assume it can't can't go through it. But... That seems like ages since I was last there. How you doing, Sam? Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> Did he just ask himself how he was doing? How are you doing, Grub? I'm all right, mate. How are you doing? Ah, oh, terrible day, mate. <laughs> oh, okay. Home sweet home. I don't know. It keeps telling me that there's weapons that I can make, but I haven't... I don't think I've got access to them yet. Clear. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. Cargo verified. Thank oh, my you. Bye. Right. Uh, so... Okay, yeah. Uh, so, deliver requested cargo. So, you want to complete all of those. What's this? Return... I don't get it. Does it mean? I think that does all three, doesn't it? Oh, so you can still use it to some degree, Daltris. You just you just get it so it almost like it drains your stamina more. Got it. Just about given up on seeing this again. Let's not uh, judge a book by its cover, though, huh? Let me take a closer look. Oh, I see what you did there. I see what you did. Nope. Very. 
very, very nice. It's exactly like I remember it. Huh, <laughs> talk about lucky. That should be uh, an awesome then, right? Although maybe it got damaged a little bit when it got blasted out of my backpack. I don't think so, though. It says 0% there, doesn't it? <laughs> Look at the path we took. <laughs> That's quite funny, actually. In, out, in, out. Shake it all about. Everything is awesome! Yeah, it is. I'll tell you what, Shay, it's crazy. It's, it's so nice playing something just completely unique, you know? I, I should have drank more coffee, actually. It's, it's a very chill game. You can, you, you know, you've got the cut scenes, you've got the, the hat quest handings. And another awesome. And I think we've got a third handing, haven't we? Lost tranquilizers. That bike is brilliant. I, I, I need to just check the uh, the controls again, though. I, I think there's a button I wasn't uh, wasn't using. Oh my god, level thirty five! Oh. You do not trust that guy. Which guy, Shades? Die Hard Man. You got Die Hard Man, Heart Man, and what? what what's the? What, who's Del Toro? Feels good, man. <laughs> Or whatever his name is. I can't tell you how grateful I am. There are few bona fide treasures left in this world. And you just saved one of them. Thank you. That's all right, mate. It was an absolute pleasure. It's been quite the adventure. Quite the adventure, to say the least. I've just suddenly realised, actually, what is the main what is the main objective now? Uh, I, I can't remember why I was coming back. Are we actually... I've got no orders for Sam. I have got a, a whole, oh my god, 86 kilos. That's, that's huge, dude. Oh, it's a retrieval one. Oh, okay, that, that could be quite interesting. Uh, yeah, I, I, we, what, what's my main objective at the moment? Am I supposed to be going back to Knot City to see Die Hard, man? Hmm. I can't actually think where my quest log would be. Orders. I don't have any quests, but I, th I think that's what we were up to, wasn't it? Yeah, we've got a big circle over here. Orders available for. So I suppose what we really want to be doing is we want to be thinking about getting that bike. Oh, shit. Where's the bike? Is the bike? Oh, God, hang on. Is the bike permanent or have I? Oh, no, I didn't think about that. There's the bike. Is that is that that's not going to disappear, is it? Oh, it's got a durability as well. Shit. I'm going to stop ramming into rocks then. It's been quite amusing, all the people that have been talking about Walking Simulator. What a bunch of bellends. <laughs> That's all I have to say, quite frankly. <laughs> Absolute testicular titwank is all I'm going to say to that comment. Right, ladies and gents, I'm afraid it is three o'clock, which means it is time for oh, me mate. to love you and leave you. Thank you very oh. much for joining us for a sponsored stream. Uh, very, very nice to be able to get a game for free, courtesy of Twitch and whatever. Uh, shenanigans that I've been doing with the team behind this so uh, yeah excellent really enjoyed it fantastic gorgeous game absolutely stunning I, I I would love to play more now tomorrow obviously we are planning hopefully on an evening stream at some point um for Ghost of Tsushima which I do believe is it might I don't think it's been delivered today because I'm pretty sure the girlfriend would have told me she, she's taken a few days off work so um we will... Well, I don't know. I don't know what we'll do tomorrow, actually. I'm not too sure. I, I might play a little bit more of this sort of post-stream because she, she's not come back into the house yet, so she must be out with a friend. But, yeah, it's been, been really enjoyable. And thank you all. Come and join us on Discord. Exclamation mark Discord in chat. We'll get you a link to the Discord server. You're more than welcome over there. If you do join us, just post once in introductions. Oh, say a quick hello. Post an emote. That's all you need to do. Post the, Just post an emote. That's all you need. Um, just so we know that you've joined. And then we'll sort out your posting permissions while the stream outro music plays. Exclamation mark Twitter will, of course, get you a link to the Twitter feed. We do stream summer days a week from quarter past eight in the morning through till about three o'clock in the afternoon. As a point of reference, it's 18 minutes past 
three here in the UK. And finally, exclamation mark YouTube will get you a link to the YouTube channel. And if you join us over there, please do consider dropping us a subscription. We'd be very, very grateful. And thank you, as always, for the subs, the resubs, the bits, the follows, the donations, and the gifted subs throughout today's stream. Thank you all very, very much indeed. Very enjoyable day. I was really looking forward to this once I, uh, once I knew we'd got a copy of it. Got it all installed yesterday. So, uh, yeah, it's been awesome. Um, I'll leave it there. Hopefully catch some of you quarter past eight tomorrow morning. Fresh coffee and whatever it is that we choose to play. I'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. We could pack our bags tomorrow. Leave all of our sorrow. See where all this road goes. Maybe San Diego. Oh. Maybe San Diego, oh Roll down all our windows Just see where the wind blows One leg out the window Sit like a flamingo, oh Sit like a flamingo, oh You can run and you can hide You can look and try to find Take a breath, open Take it one day at a time You can run